Right. Can you guys see the game? Oh, shit! Thank you, Commander Cano! Thank you for the five... The seven... Oh. Guys! Guys, I'm okay, all right. Let's see the battle pass. <laughs> Let's see that battle pass. I'm a bit nervous, guys. I'm a bit nervous. Can you guys see the game okay? Is it like, a good balance? I don't want the game too loud. You may want to be hearing me and the stuff, you know. Yeah, I saw that too. Cal on the subs from Tahari. <laughs> Thanks for all the subs, guys. There's a lot of them. I'm, I'm trying to keep up with them all. Yes, sir. Sounds all good. All right. Let's get into it. Thanks for all the subs, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There's going to be a lot of new people tonight. I love that. You, you guys don't have to come down. Oh, I've been penalized, guys. Been banned. I gen guide's over. Can't play the guide. Let me just... Uh, thanks for all the So many subs. Thank you, Elliot. Number five. Guys, there's so many, pe so many new people. It's hard to keep up. Uh, I'm just going to try and... Uh, do my thing, all right? I pre, but just know if, if I miss any subs, or if you're trying to talk to me and stuff, I really wish I could, but uh, I'm, I'm really busy. <laughs> so I really appreciate every single one. I hope you guys know that. Oh man. Hey, oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna be honest, guys. I'm stalling. I'm really nervous. I'm really nervous. I get nervous. Okay, I'll tell you why I get nervous before, before doing the guides. It's because as a content creator, it's hard to do this kind of content when the jokes and the and the actual video is not in your control it's up to the guide you know what i mean if, if the guide wants to be funny if the guide wants to be whatever it's not my choice so it's like that's it's, it's hard as a content creator to kind of you know invest in something which is not right you know but anyway Are you guys ready i think we'll get we'll get started a little bit shaky yet. Yeah. I'm going to take the alerts off the screen so I can get a, uh, for the video. Say hi to YouTube, everyone. Say hi to YouTube. All right. We're starting. And one more time before we get into any of this, as always, what? Oh, I'm going to actually get the guide out. You know, pop this bad boy open. There it is. There it is. Whatever the guide says, I am going to do. If the guide says something stupid like, use a broken sword, that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. And uh, another thing I'd like to say is that, you know, one more other thing to keep in mind. This is only meant to be a bit of fun. You know, when I get a bit, I might get a bit shouty. I might get a bit frustrated. You know, when I'm doing all that, it's just a joke. Please remember that. I, I love it when the guides are being silly and they're a little rambunctious. I like that. So whenever I seem a bit tilted, just know it's, it's, it's kind of just for the video, for a bit, bit of a joke. Nothing too serious. Just remember, it's all a bit of fun. And that's it. <sighs> Before we start, boys, again, I just want to remind people, usually, the, the, this is a big guy, by the way. Have you seen that? It's a, it's a thick boy. He's a thick boy. Now, usually, these IGN guides are about, I'd say, 60. Thank you. Thank you for all the subs. So, it's so many people, it's hard to keep up. Thank you all so much. I really appreciate it. Now, usually, like, Blood Bot, you know, now, usually the, the other IGN guides, usually they're about 60 to 50 pages. This is 81 pages, our biggest yet. So, uh, we'll see how we get on. Sure, I'll, I think I'll just start reading. This is IGN's guide for Dark Souls 3. Welcome to Dark Souls 3. That's right, this brutal bad boy game is back for another. But this time, it's for keeps. We've been bashing away at Dark Souls 3 for weeks now. Dying. Little sub. Thank you, thank you. Dying over and over again. Don't be like us. Learn from our mistakes. Profit from the sweat of our brows. So, step inside to the game that even us, game journalists fear. Now, <laughs> they, they, again, this is interesting. This is something I find kind of interesting about this whole series. Yes, yes indeed. indeed. Something I find interesting about the whole series. It is called Love. I don't give a fuck what it's called, Love. Get off my screen. So I quite find interesting about this series is as time goes on, you know, this, I think this is the first instance in this whole series where it's a bit concerning because they're starting to become 
a bit self-aware. I just said that there, that even us game journalists fear. Now, in the past, you know, they've kind of gone into these guides a bit like, oh, we're, we're going to show you the best things and stuff. But now, I feel like this is the, right on the cusp. Right on the cusp. How many arrows will you have to farm today? We might not even do an arrow build. You know, probably. This is right on the cusp of them just starting to become self-aware. Which is concerning because, you know, when they become so more self-aware, they're starting to be less jokey and stuff. Anyway. The golden age is over. And so, like, yeah, that, that early golden age of, like, we'll never see another float down around the office at this point. At this point, the office is strict. They're self-aware. They're just doing the guide, you know, but... Let's see what they've got to say. Dark Souls 3 is hard. It's not impossible. And no, you don't need to get good. The self-aware kind of works both ways because now they're saying shit like get good. Yes. Oh, no, I've read that bit. In this, okay, we've got a build. I made sure to get the build. The build was on a separate page. I got the build. Thank you for the subs. That is so many people. So many people. Thank you. All right. In this... Dark Souls 3 build guide. We will be using a build which complements the safe and cautious player. This stealthy ranged PvE build uses the bow. This Fuck's sake. You just knew this was gonna you just knew that was gonna happen. This stealthy raged PvE build uses the bow to pick off unsuspecting enemies. Well, you just knew that was gonna happen, didn't you? Another bow that is a trilogy of bow builds. Oh! But hang on guys, hang on guys. Hang on. It's a bit different this time around. While though, hang on, while your magic provides you with a stealthy utility to keep those would-be vicious baddies unaware of your presence. So, you, we are gonna farm arrows. we're not going to farm arrows. We're not. <laughs> I like this next line. IGN actually has... For everyone complaining in the chat, everyone complaining, IGN has a retort. Hang on, IGN, you're thinking. This sneaky shit is all very well good and all, but no matter what I do, a boss always detects me and then smashes me while I'm knocking an arrow. Yes, indeed. And that's why we bring a friend. Now, 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 now. I've always thought about this. What if the guides told us to like, summon you guys? What if the guides told us to co-op all the like, bosses and stuff? You know? IGN, uh, Dark Souls... Three smiley face. I always thought about this. What if the guy tells you to summon friends? This is the deal. Because I could summon you guys, sure, uh, but then, like, I don't know, I'll be doing my build, and then someone come in with a plus 15 Uch Katana, smash the boss's cock off for me. So here's the deal. If you want to join me on this adventure, you have to make the same exact character as me. So if you want to follow along, boys, be my guest. I, I, it, the guide says, yes, if you're struggling, Make sure we bring friends. I am on PC. I'm on the banned server. So if you're banned on PC, you can join me along. Try and build along with me. He just goes on to say about summoning and stuff. And yeah, down here. We have a few tricks up our sleeves here. For those wanting a more relaxed time. However, this build is not for everyone. Some would call... Darkborn gave us sweet baby angel. Dark Souls gave teeny oh, tiny man. buttercup. What will the G-I-N people call us this time? We'll see, we'll see. Some would call what we're going to do here cheesy. <laughs> and that's page one. And what I like on the next page, in big bold at the top, it's okay to cheese, really. Boys, it's going to be a bit of a cheesy time. Some people will poo-poo the approach. <laughs> what the fuck? Some people will poo-poo the approach detailed in this guide, but you could quietly ignore them because shh, but fuck up. If I see a single person, if I see a single fucking, if I see a single person poo-pooing my approach, I'm banning you from the channel. I don't give a fuck. I'm banning comments in the video. I don't give a fuck. There's absolutely nothing wrong with this playstyle, and FromSoft does not want to prevent you from seeing all that the game has to offer. Unfortunately, the difficulty curve is too off-putting for some. The half-joking, but unfortunately too frequent response of get good, learn to play the game the real hardcore way, is 
a bit too much. Left diuresis as a ghoul. I agree. Ban I'm banning all poopers. I'm banning all poopers tonight. And here we go. It's starting class. Yep. Oh, starting as the bandit offers you a ball right away. Design your beauty. Okay, okay. Oh, no, no, no. That's our class. We've got the bandit. We've got a ball right away. Where's the bandit? Did they mean Feath? I think they meant, I mean, I think they meant Feath. Okay, well. <laughs> Design your beautiful character. No, we're not going to the prom with. It just said, no, I'm not going to the prom with you. Well, what's the point, IGN? And be sure, okay. Oh, now I'm just reading more stuff. Um, burial gift. Be sure to pick up the Bone of Souls as our starting item. Have we got, oh, we have. Okay. There we go. Boom, bam, bam. And there we go. Bing bong, baby. No problem. Run over. Lenny, it's been 20 minutes. I still don't have any cat memes. Oh, there you go. All right, guys. We are now starting the IGN guide. Oh, my goodness. I don't think I've ever played the bandit. No, fuck. Don't think I've ever played the thief. So, um, I hope this starting weapon's good. Actually, no, you said the starting bow. So how many arrows? I've got 30 arrows to shoot. Okay. I like, put, I like putting the bow in the right hand, personally. By the way, thanks for the subs. All the new people here. Hello, everyone. Sorry, I, I'm, I'm, try I'm a bit distracted by this. I appreciate every single one. Just know that. All right. So, we're starting off here. There isn't too much to worry about in this tutorial area. After you've woken up, move forward as a grunt. Oh, yeah. This is something it's you guys who are new here will... Uh, it's not in the videos. This is what I like to call waffle. It's just a lot of just kind of like, go here, kill the enemy, go back, pick the item. I'll read it off. Um, the single enemy here who should be able to dispatch in a single blow. When the, branch path, when the path branches, head right and get the soul. Then continue to the main path, kill another grunt. Take the action flask and move it forward. Just a lot of kind of, kill the guy, get the item, kill the guy, move forward, you know, so a lot of that kind of stuff. This provides us with an excellent opportunity to figure out what character you're going to be. So yeah, he's saying like, oh yeah, no, you can just kind of train up here. Since you've only just started, why not start again with a new class? To tr start again with a new class so you can try and figure out which play style is best for you. Okay. All right. Start again. I don't give a fuck. Oh, okay. I don't give a fuck. I like to be part of the best boy club. Love you, big dude. Cheers. <laughs> Thank you. It's okay. This is this is the thing about this guide. It seemed to be a lot more choice on my end. We start the front. Let's go, <laughs> guys. Are we stuck in an infinite loop? Are we now going to have to go to the? I think now we have to go to the top of the paragraph. To go down to that bit again and just loop back. We're, we're in an infinite loop, guys. We are hard, we are hard locked in now. I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. IGN here is clearly giving us a choice. I don't want choice. I can't fucking think straight. Just tell, I'm doing it IGN's way or no way. It said bandit. I'm doing bandit. I'm going to fuck. Yep, it's just telling me. Kill all the grunts. Pick up all the items. It's all going all right. Boom, boom. How are we all doing? Now, 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 now we get to go back into the game and play normally. How's everyone doing? Are you all excited? You all excited, guys? Get some of your predictions. I like seeing you guys try and uh, do some predictions. Get some predictions in the chat. What do you think is going to happen? What do you think is going to happen? Some predictions, please. You put this fan down here. Boom. No, it, it said, I, I read something about the Crystal Lizard. Uh, pick up this item. Um, yep, yep, yep. Crystal Lizard. Yeah, um... In the water path ahead, you can investigate a bit further. It leads to a Crystal Lizard. Pretty tough for you at the present, but feel free to come back later. Yep. Early Dancer. Well, that's a given. <laughs> parry Gundyr. Nah, they wouldn't say that right. They wouldn't get us the Parry Gundyr. Usually when, I, um, when I'm playing these things, you know, it's, it's paragraphs and paragraphs. I'm like, go here, pick up this item. So usually in these things, I just like go in every location, kill all the guys I can. 
How good are my parries? With this shield, sh not good. With the actual parry shields, I'm pretty good, actually, though. Nice Zoot and Azirel any in stream. Name a better way to spend a Wednesday evening. That's it, baby. That's what it's all about, baby. Thanks for the By the way, thanks for the subs. So, guys, a lot of uh, kind of comments and stuff trying to keep them all. All right. Yep, yep, yep. All good. Oh, now we're down here. Yep. Up, up the path. You'll find your first bonfire just around the corner. There it is. So, if you should kindle it and activate the 70 of Ash fast travel point. I, I like the term fast. It's not a bonfire. It's a fast travel point. It's, They've been playing too many EA games. Uh, you'll receive the you'll receive the rest emote in brackets. Nap time. I want a bit of fucking nap time. Hang on, boy. Hang on. Hang on a bit of nap. Nap time. That's it, boys. That's it. That's good. Show me, 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 me. This is a page over. Uh, oh no, he's moving down the mountain. You face grunts. Path forks, go left and jump onto the tomb to get a tiny shard. Yep, 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 yep. This is what it's all about. I, I can read off all the waffle, but it's just this kind of... I, I say this a lot. It's so, I don't include in the videos, obviously, because it's just so much. A lot of these guys have a lot of what I call waffle, where it's just like, kill everything and pick up all the items. If you missed the jump earlier, you can go circle back the other way. Now go around and get the other three grunts on the path. And the other gruff by some graves will make aggro. Check out the graves in the area. You may find a cliff reading down. One shield grunt is here and one crossbow grunt is leading here. Try to do the melee one as close as you can. But what? So the other one doesn't aggro you. And don't fall off the cliff. Your reward is it's just like blah, 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 blah. You know what I mean? A lot of it is just, there's an enemy here. Here's the item. So I don't, like, that kind of shit you guys, obviously we don't fucking need to read all of it. Whenever the, I play these guides, I'm under the firm assumption, kill everything at least once and pick up all the items I can. Bobo. I'm getting a bunch of items here. But no, it gives me more time. Can I talk to you guys? Now, there's so many new people here. I love seeing so many new people here. Hope everyone's having a great day. Hope everyone's excited. I get really nervous before these kind of things. I hope I'm not kind of, uh, you know... Hope I'm not too uh, weird right now. I get really nervous. Yeah, I've tried. I've been streaming Liza P. I actually quite like it. More than demo. I didn't like the demo. I didn't like the demo too much. Abo. Oh. Abo. All right, here, righty, righty, righty. Oh wait, is that an item? Yeah. Okay then. Okay. We're coming up to our first boss already. Oh what the? Okay. Here we are. There's nothing to see apart from the guys. <laughs> so it's like it says to go into here. Go to the boss room. Yep. It's all good here. You can turn around this area. You can go around this area freely. As there's a kneeling figure in the middle who won't aggro. There's nothing to see apart from this guy's obvious back problems. <laughs> so approach and remove the sword. As prompted to begin our first boss fight. I don't I can't pronounce this. Edex Uludex Gundir. Our oh, Gundy is our first boss. Your, re your, your first real Dark Souls 3 fight. We're so proud of you. Th thank you, Arjun. I fucking appreciate that, dickhead. This is not a proper boss, per se. Oh, fuck you, then. But it's challenging enough to be the stumbling block for many new players. Yeah, Gundy are here. Souls veterans will have no problems. It's the standard issue of big guy tactics. Circling around, rolling behind them, and smacking him on his big old booty a few times. But here's the shocker. There's a phase two. And he just goes on to say, yep, yeah, more circling around. And if you struggle with this fight, remembering it's designed to be the basics of Dark Souls combat. Stamina management, blocking versus rolling, balancing aggression, where temperance according to your means. This is really quite, yeah. Some really cool kind of, of course, beginners aren't going to grasp those concepts, but it's kind of good to keep them in mind. If you really struggle here, consider, consider starting a new save to try another class. I'll just play another game. Well, hopefully we don't struggle too much or the video's over. Okay, the video the video's gonna be over, so <laughs> hopefully we don't <laughs> fuck it up. Um Yep, it's all saying, yep, that's about it. Play another game, gotcha. Well it's a standard big guy tactics of circling around and hitting his big old booty. FIFA? Come, wait guys, if I fuck this up, are we gonna play FIFA? Hang on, hang on a sec. I don't have to hit his booty. Fucking okay. boom, boom. 
I really hope I don't fuck this up. I really hope I don't fuck this up. I don't want to play FIFA. I, don't, I do not want to play FIFA on stream. It's the most embarrassing thing ever. Oh my god! Wait, this dagger's got bleed? Oh, I forgot this dagger has bleed. I'm so actually, one thing, I thought they were going to mention the black fire bombs, you know? That's the thing about these guides. They always mention, like, pick up, picking up all of the items. They always pick up all the items, but they never really tell them where to use them. So obviously, black the fire bombs right now would be perfect, but... You know, fair enough. I'll, I have no problem smacking that booty. He's got back problems. Send him to the fucking chiropractor. Here we are. Boom! It's Carl Sword. Congratulations! Bring out the confetti! That is your first Dark Souls boss. It's a good feeling, isn't it? Pat yourself in the back. And now let's head on over to our first... Oh, just off there. So to our next goal, Phylic Shrine. Where's the confetti? It's in the edit, dickhead. I can edit it in. Whoa. Thanks for all the subs. Sorry, uh, I've disabled the subs appearing on screen because I, I want it to be clean for the video. I appreciate every single one, though. Thank you, guys. I'm sorry if I've missed... Oh, I like trying to thank people individually for all the subs. There's been so much happening. So many things to focus on. Like, I don't... Like, Rat and Boy, thank you for the sub there. Hey, Lenny. Looking forward oh. to see the new video. You did it! Celebrate your victory with a few calming breaths. <laughs> and press on to the main hub. When Gundy is dead, you can open the double doors. Pass through and get the broken sword. Yep, okay. I hopefully don't have to use that. Please, please don't. Uh, yep. Um, I was just saying, yep. I was <laughs> just saying about this area. This is Actually, this is a funny bit here. Uh, facing the door, pass through the right, and face the dog. If you've never played a Souls game, if you've never played a Souls game before, these guys are bastards. <laughs> I don't need your That's true. screen messages, video man. I just want the funny emotes. That's true. That's true. I'm going to get this dog because he's a fucking bastard. Oh, a uh, bastard. There he is. Oh, there he is. And now, obviously, I'm picking up all the items here, too. The emotes are epic. Yeah, honestly, there's a bunch of new people here. If you don't know what Twitch is, or oh, so, there's so many subs happening, what subs are, you get a bunch of emotes. Hey, if you've got a, if you, if you got a subscription, put your favorite emote in the chat. You can use those anywhere. So even if you go down to your friends, if you go down to Fortnite Ninja stream, you can use them there. So it's a good, it's a cool way of supporting me and getting some a bit, like, you know, back for it too. You know, some full emotes. Does it mention NPC aggro? It does mention that we're going to be stealthy with some utility magic. I'm assuming like stuff like, like spook or hidden body. I'm assuming what it means by that. But it doesn't mention kind of like a general strategy. Anyway, and now let's go to Phylic Shrine. It does mention... The guy with the uh, Uchi Katana, but he says, oh, no, if you come back later with a bow, he's easy to cheese. <laughs> By sniping away. Should we do that now? No, I don't, I don't think we have enough arrows. Hang on, before we go in, it says, this guy's really worth killing as he drops an Uchi Katana. Very powerful. If you come back later, well, I've got a bow right now. It says, if I, it says to come back later with a bow, but I've got one. I hope I have enough arrows. Um... He's easy to cheese by sniping, running away, and sniping again. Boring, but rewarding. <laughs> Are you really telling me that? Don't say. I'm not doing this. Where is he? Where is he? What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Okay. Well. Well. Okay. IGN was right. Okay, IGN. When you get me, mate, you can look at all these people who died. When you get me, IGN, you get me. Fair play to you. Fair fucking play to you. IGN stays winning. IGN stays trapped. There we go. Yep. Um, I, I'm going to quit and restart for the Uchi Katana because I said it was very powerful. <laughs> Yeah, I came back onto the path and I was like, wait, where the fuck is he? And then, <laughs> plus five at least. At least a plus five. Um, hopefully the item's just here. There we go. Fair play to you, Igen. When you get me, you get me. And I said, yeah, that's got to be a point. That's got to be a point. So I'm just picking up all the items because that's usually what the guides... Time to do. Now it said that the katana is powerful, but not to use it. 
it said that we're gonna be doing a bow build. Now the thing about the bow build though, okay, I actually wanna talk about that later. Because now we're in Phylink Shrine. Boom! Yep, put the coiled sword in, as it always it says. Phylink Shrine is your haven against the horrors of Dark Souls 3. This area serves as your main hub, and it's full of friendly NPCs. Do you even do quests, bro? I really don't want to do an IGN quest. Put it that way. Never attack anyone here! If you're using control pads with triggers, be careful about putting it down. As you, lest you accidentally hit someone, like us! Oh, you can just hit people on purpose, you crazy son of a bitch! Have that, love. Oh, fuck. Hang on. That's actually not bad. Yeah, feel free to explore at your own leisure. Yeah, take in the sights and sounds. As you, spend, as you will be spending a lot of time here. Maybe the most important NPC here is the Firekeeper, who, like always, is responsible for levelling up our character. The Dark Souls... Oh, sorry. I'm just looking at it. Hello, hello, love. You all right? You doing all right tonight, love? The Dark Souls 3 Firekeeper is pretty cool. But for us, our favourite Souls level up lady is the Bloodborne doll. Especially when she's doing the Gangnam style. What? Um, I Jen, not sure what the fuck you mean by that. <laughs> not sure what the fuck that means, I Jen. Um, <laughs> hey Lenny, editing the video, G commission an artist to do the Bloodborne doll doing Gangnam style. Th there we go. Great, great news. Right there we are. The huh? <laughs> huh? But there you go. Uh, that's actually one little thing that I like a lot. Is that in the community, we call them Souls Waifus, right? But they call them the Level Up Ladies. I like that more. Can we start calling them the Level Up Ladies rather than Souls Waifus? I think that's Has better. I like that. Paper cut? Oh, yeah, I've got paper cuts for sure. I've had paper cuts for sure. All right, that's that pitch done. Um, yeah, just talking about the uh, whole, whole thing here. Oh, the Shrine Maiden, yep. Oh, talk to her. Uh, inventory is expanded upon giving her ashes. She can be killed, but will respawn and jack up her prices repeatedly if you're foolish enough to murder her over and over again. Why? IGN seems to know a lot about what happens when you kill these NPCs. They keep... Andre the Smith talked to him several times to unlock the hurrah mode. Yep. Um, Andre can be killed, but will respawn. And what, what? IGN... You may be asking yourself. <laughs> okay. We'll respawn and refuse upgrades. You may be asking yourself. How do we know so much about what happens when everyone dies? Let's just call it one bad afternoon of gamer rage. Leave it at that. Guys. I don't want to hear anyone talking about IGN's bad fucking day, right? I've had a, IGN, if you had a bad day, mate, I've got a perfect video for you. IGN, that's the thing. IGN lad has come back. I, I, just imagine, I can just see it now. The IGN guy comes home from a hard day in the office, sits down on his sofa, you know, he's like, oh, like, with a beer in one hand, he's just like, oh, fucking hell, this is shit. Boots up Dark Souls 3, just, just laps around the fucking violence right now for you. <laughs> Just have to do the gamer rage, guys. Imagine the scenes. <laughs> Imagine dying to like dancer over and over. Like that's it. I've died to dancer. <laughs> I've died to dancer. Back to Phoenix Shrine. <laughs> Everyone's ever fucking got this. I'm gonna start doing that. Whenever I get angry at this game, I'm just gonna go back here. And I fucking have to lash into everyone here. Uh, oh, I have to talk to him. Get the hurrah mode. There we go. Cool, 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 cool. I'll be sure if I ever struggle at a boss to come back here and take my aggression out on everyone. Sure, it seems to be the best way of solving my issues. Heck? But we're not done yet. Thanks for the sub. Hello, Lexiglas. When you're ready to progress further, the bonfire awaits you. Or, if you would rather do some highly recommended treasure hunting, stick around. 
Well, I don't know how much treasure there's left here, really, unless they're doing the, the jump skip. The Shrine Handmaiden sells the tower key for 20,000 souls. You'll easily be able to raise this right now before heading out into the world. As long as you haven't leveled up. Oh, fuck, I've le I haven't leveled up. As long as you haven't leveled up yet, go back through the tutorial a couple of times. This time, clearing out the giant Titanite Lizard and the Uchi Katana NPC. You okay. You're also free to sell. Oh, my fucking God. How, wait, how many souls are the guys outside worth? How many souls are the guys outside worth? 20,000 souls! And I can't go there! It says bef how many, how many, How many souls do I get for these guys? How many souls do I get for these guys? Like 100? Like 50? Okay, if it's like, if it's like 50 or 100, that's alright. Alright, how many souls? How many souls? How many souls? 20. Oh my god, that's a thousand kills. That's a thousand. What do you- They said go around the tutorial! I says here! Go back out throughout the tutorial a couple of times! What do you mean a couple of times? They've killed these- It's a thousand kills! Right. Okay, it says here. It shouldn't be too hard to amass. If you're particularly desperate, the glum-looking bloke seated next to the stairs of the Fire Link is a great punching brag. He's a bit depressed about the whole unkindled thing. Oh, it's, it's saying if you're also free to sell any unwanted extra items, such as our starting soul. Is that why they picked this as our starting item? 2000's helpful. Right. Fuck. I'm it. I have to farm 20,000 souls before we even begin. What's that item? I really hope you don't fucking die. Right. So as far as I'm aware, I'm trying to raise this money as much as I can. Yeah, it, it says to go back out and clear out the extra NPCs such as the Crystal Lizard and the... We already got the Uchi Katana NPC. We already got him. We already got him. 20,000 souls. It says I'm free to sell anything I find. I'm selling embers. Yeah, I can sell embers. I'm selling all my shit. I'm selling armor. I, anything. It says I'm free to sell anything that I don't want. That's like two souls. Fuck, man. Oh, for fuck's sake. I've just started. I'm already in fucking Tesco fucking deal. I mean, Tesco meal deal mode. Look at this. 7,500. I have to kill another 650. This is a ridiculous step for a beginner. Oh, fuck. Look on, look on. I can, okay. The thing is, I'm assuming this is all for the soul ring. Because the way I see IGN is that they deal in net profits. And they see the uh, ideally you getting the, the extra souls, like sur sur silver ring. They see that getting that early as being a payoff for the 20,000. So getting that early as, as early as possible is nothing but a bonus for them. That's the way I'm seeing it. Early Esther Shard. Yeah, I see that too. Oh, fuck. Don't, I, I don't want to die and lose my souls, please. I don't want to die and lose my souls, please. I'm really desperate here. If I lose these souls, it is so fucking unbelievably Jova right now. Oh, stamina. Don't die, please don't die. Oh. Mm. Uh, please don't die. That nice. It's good, it's good. No one wants FIFA. Yeah, no one wants FIFA. Um, I'm just gonna spam my one. Oh, 4,000 souls! Okay, guys, it's just another 400 kills. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, wait. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. How many is that now? That's it, guys. Just another 350 kills. We'll get it. 
We're getting there. What's our... Walk here. Fuck, what's our best farming route? Wait, there's a chest. There's a chest with an ember, I think. It's, no, that's that's a mod. Is that a mod? I remember I played the Convergence mod or whatever, and there's a chest here with that stuff in it. Yeah, I have more souls, yeah, for sure. It's a mod, yeah, fucking sorry. It's probably the last time I played this game. Right. Oh, yeah, I can use what... It said I can sell whatever I find. Or whatever I don't want, it said. I can sell whatever I don't want. I don't need embers. That's like a thousand. How much does a dog at Firelink drop? Oh, fuck, if I have to farm dogs. I'm sat here an hour into the guide farming fucking dogs. <sighs> IGN, man. I don't know, IGN. You're off to a pretty bad start here, IGN. I don't know about this one. Okay. Actually, it gives me a bit of time to have a bit of a talk, you know. There's a bit... Should we go? Actually, no, let's go back. And... Okay, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Let's go back, make sure... We've got all the items we can sell. Like, all the white items on the floor. Oh, my God. It actually is 20,000 to go. Oh, fuck. I'm going to be here all day. Is this just going to be day one? Oh, my fucking Christ. On the plus side, I might be the only person who's... <laughs> imagine the scenes. You're the firekeeper. Imagine you're this. Imagine you're the firekeeper. Like, oh, yeah, you know. The, the uh, unkindled one's just here. It's like, oh, by the way, love. Got your, your fucking firekeeper. So, like, wait, what? What? <laughs> This might be the world's first and quickest Firekeeper soul. Story time, yeah? Well, maybe, yeah. Well, okay, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. We're going to sell off all... We're going to sell off all our things. Let's try and get all the white items. There's going to be, like... I'm sure we can get more white items around here. I've not been picking them all up. There's one up there. I thought okay, they might drop something, too. Okay, that's a thousand. That's a thousand. That's a thousand. That's a thousand. Anything here? Anything here? Oh! Okay, that might be like 200. <laughs> God. I'm in Tesco fucking meal deal mode right now. How much is this dog worth? Oh my God, it's tense. Oh my fucking God. Who wants to farm another fucking 700 dogs? All right. Yeah, also, yeah, there's something more up here. Now, he's not dropped the tree seed yet, but I know there's some there's an item up here. There's an item up here. Okay, that helps, that helps. Whoops, I accidentally did the skip. Whoops, I accidentally... Oh, guys, oh. I accidentally... Oh, okay, no, no, no. Fuck's sake, come on. Right. <laughs> Invalid. Do it again. <laughs> Thank you for the sub there, Cactus. Right, okay. So we got, we killed all the majority, we, we killed all the mini, we killed all the mini bosses, the lizard and the Uchikatana. We've not leveled up. I don't need those. Don't need those. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. I don't need that. I don't know that. I don't need that. Fuck. Okay, it's the chime. Okay, they dropped chimes with 100. Don't need that. Right. That's me. I've got 15,000. How many kills is that? That's a lot of kills. Why can't I just go there, you prick? Why can't I just go there? The, the guys there are like 100 souls and they just sat on the ground. I need to figure out the best farming spot. I need to figure out the best farming spot. Okay, that's 250 more kills. I've not killed the guy, though. I've not killed... I've not killed the guy, though. The uh, Crest Falling Warrior. Do I just do... Are we killing the Crest Falling... It says you can. What do you guys think? Should I do it? It said... Um, the souls shouldn't be too hard to amass. Oh, fucking... How much is a... How much is a fading soul? How much is a fucking fading soul? On my Tesco club card. Okay, that's like two kills. Okay, that's, that's not bad. If you're particularly desperate, the glob-looking bloke usually seated next to the stairs of the bonfire is a great punching bag. He's a great punching bag. He's a bit depressed about the whole unkindled thing. So best be showing him the door out if he can't handle the heat. Oh, the door's right fucking there if you want to leave, mate. I'm having him. I'm having him. 
I'm having... The door's right there if you want to fucking leave, mate. I'm having him. I'm having him. Show him the door. Oh, I'll show him the door. <sighs> Get Oski, bro. No, the Dragon Quest line. Oh, there's no way I'm doing IGN's Dragon Quest line. Right. I really don't want to lose these souls. We'll be fine, guys. We'll be fine. Okay, we're good. We're good. Now, this guy does a lot of parries. But he can't parry a jumping attack. So, I think this is the way to do it. Shit. No, no. Yeah, this guy parries for crazy. I don't want him to parry me. He's going to fuck me up. Don't hit the firekeeper, mate. She's doing Gangnam style. Leave her alone. I'm really scared of the parry. Okay, I'll, I'll take that. I'll take that. Shit, okay. When, when he's got his... No, no, no. When he's got his two-handed sword out, I'm going to go in hard with the R1s. Like now. Because he can't parry me now. That's good. And he puts his shield down just in time on the jumping attack. Don't heal. Fucker. Don't, don't, don't parry me. Don't parry me. This guy parries so accurately, man. I, I'm scared. Ah! Ah! No! No! I'm so scared of this guy. Yeah, thankfully on the jumping... He drops his shield on the, on the jumping attack. Yeah, yeah, can I just remind people, I'm still not into... I'm, I, I, I'm what, like an hour in? 40 minutes in. I'm 40 minutes in, I've still not been to fucking Lothric. Still shagging about in the tutorial. Okay. Nice. No, you... It's okay. <gasps> Bleed! Nice! How much is this you have? That's got to be his last Estus, yeah, it is. No! I'm all out of Estus. I should have sat down, shouldn't I? Okay, okay, it's okay, it's good. Yes! Okay, how many souls? How many souls are you fucking worth, mate? A thousand! Okay, that's like what? 50 kills? <laughs> I don't, okay, I'm gonna sell heavy, I'm gonna, I'm selling the heavy gem. I'm selling heavy gem. I'm in Tesco fucking meal deal mode right now, boys! How much heavy? 300, yep. Yeah, don't need that. Watch me need that later. Right. That's as many souls as I can get without farming. How many kills is that? That's not too bad. That's like 100 kills. That's like 100 kills. Plus, there's a chance I could get Desperate Souls or the Chime for 100 again. So it's not too bad. It's just not too bad. I'm literally starting off this guide, checking the fucking... <laughs> I'm literally starting this guide, checking the fucking couch for pennies and shit. Right. So now I'm left with about 200 kills here. But also, we could get drops. We could get Desperate Souls. Oh! Fading Souls. It's okay. I'm probably about 100 of these. Not too bad. While I'm doing this, uh, maybe we can have a story. Pass the time. Let's have a fuck it. Let's have a story. Fuck it. I'm getting all the. I'm getting all the drops. Give me that fucking shit. Nice. I think this is the, I think this is the the quickest farming route. This. This little loop here. Go up here. I'll go up here. Kill these two and the bo uh, kill these three and the bonfires just appear. Yeah, this is got this is gotta be our our best farming route here. Yeah, this is gotta be our best farming route here. I'm just loop it. All right. Bit of a, do I have a bit of a story time? Let's have, fuck it, let's have a bit of a story time. I'll tell you a good one. I should tell you a good one. Usually my stories are about like me when I was a kid. But I've got to catch you something that happened to me quite recently, right? This happened to me quite recently. You guys might know I actually did a, a early armored car stuff. And I don't mean like, oh, they give me a key. I mean, they actually brought me out to an event in London. That was really, you know what? Fair, I was actually really proud of myself because I've never, I've never done something like directly under FromSoft like that. I got invited out to like an event and play it early. I was, re I'm really proud of that. I really am. And um, honestly, if they ever want to do anything like that, like if they want to do anything like that again, get, get in touch, man. I fucking love that shit. But anyway, 
I was really nervous. It's like, you know, it's not like it's, a, it's not like I was like, oh, it's the biggest deal ever. It's just like, I was really nervous. I was like, oh man, I'm going to get, like bringing me out to the city, play this uh, game early. I get to record my own footage and make a video. I was really nervous, right? And I did a massive cringe. I'm going to meet Varty. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. In the back of my head, I was a bit like, what if someone like I am Pineapple or Varty's there? They weren't. <laughs> but I did a massive cringe. You know, the thing is, boys, I'm not just a pretty face. That's the thing about me. I'm not just a pretty face. I like to try and think of myself. You know what? You know, I'm, I am a bit. I'm a fucking massive geek, but you know, I. I should be all right in social. I should be okay in social situations. I wasn't. I get there, right? The first person I get there like, super early, right? The first person I meet is the top of PR for England FromSoft. A lovely lass. She was a lovely lass called her uh, Shante. That's her name, Shante. Lovely lass. And says, "Oh, you're here early. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you know, okay." Um, and she goes, "Oh, cool, cool. Well." I'm Shante. <laughs> and I thought she meant on Shante. <laughs> like a Dark Souls greeting. So I was like, oh, <laughs> on Shante. <laughs> to the top of Dark Souls PR, right? <laughs> and then, no, no, it gets worse. <laughs> and then she goes, oh, no, no. I'm Shante. And I go, ah, I'm shot <laughs> again. And she looks like, like she looks like me. Like, she looks like me like I'm a fucking freak. She looks like me. I'm like a fucking freak. And um, <laughs> yeah. She, apart from that, she's lovely. Um. That was quite literally the, the top dog of FromSoft PR. If I ever do an event with FromSoft again, it has to go with her. It has to go through her. And she now she thinks of that. She thinks of that now. So yeah, that's me fucked, isn't it? Hey, Shante, if you're watching this. On, on Shante. <laughs> <laughs> What do you mean minus points for Lenny? Nah, no, I don't get minus points for that. I don't get minus points for that. No, I don't. No, 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 no. No, I don't. So I think that's me uh, blacklisted from FromSoft events forever. So Elder Ring DLC, don't come to my channel for it because I'm not getting it <laughs> after that shit. Uh, after that, I'm not getting early access. <laughs> Did she extort you five whole gold coins to go through a tunnel? No, I, I could. Oh, she didn't lex, but thanks for the bits. I could tell you why I said on Shanté because I was I was just playing Dark Souls One, and it's what they say. It's what Alpha the cat. It's Al. It's that fucking kitty cat's fault. Alpha the cat. She goes on Shanté. You've got a rather pleasant smell. It's that kitty cat's fault. It's that one. It's it's sweet shell. It's sweet shell choir from Dark Souls Two. She goes on Shanté. It's that. It's always the kitty cat, boys. Maybe I need an IGN guide about talk to fucking people. Did she say you have a pleasant smell? No. Enchanté. <laughs> Little kitty cat. Blaming the cats again. Bro! If this guy comes up to me like, yo, I'm gonna say Enchanté, the chicks dig it. The chicks dig it if you say Enchanté, bro. <laughs> How many more kills is that? Nah, fucking don't know. We're getting close though, guys. We're getting close. Been out the tutorial. We're an hour in. I'm saving the souls for a big turn at the end. A big, I think a big turn at the end. It'll be good. That's my little um. But you know, in all honesty, I was really proud of that. When I got out to do early armored cores, I, I know like think about armored core. I think like, armored cores kind of like been and gone. You know what I mean? Like, I think people loved it, no mistake, but it's like, it's not stuck like Dark Souls 3 and etc. has. And it's been and gone, but I think everyone loved it, right? And, that was, and 
I, I'm really proud of that. I'm really proud of doing some under like from soft directly like that. Did I meet any other big sh streamers or YouTubers? No, but I got recognised by a lovely guy who sometimes comes to the stream called uh, Dom's Round Dom's Round Table. Lovely guy. And again, he was the, even though like in that situation, if you if you meet, imagine if you met your ex, if you met Varty Video, you'd probably be a bag of nerves. It was the other way around. He was really sweet. He was like, hey, you're uh, nice to see you, man. I love your stuff. And I was the cringe lord. I was like, <laughs> yeah. I was fucking. I was I was massive cringe. Fuck me. We're doing all right. We've got a lot, eight, eight of these souls. That's like eight times five. What's that? 400. Getting to the last a thousand-ish. It's going a bit quicker than I thought. It's going a bit quicker than I thought. Yeah, we've all been cringe once in our life. That's the thing, Desi, I know. But what happened when I was like, if that happened when I was a kid, I wouldn't mind, but... I'm fucking 29. I'm still saying on Shantae to birds in the fucking FromSoft event. You know what I mean? Does my nothing. Look at our right fucking geezer. <laughs> but I know. I think, I don't think she, the thing is, I bet she's used to dealing with like massive, like, either like antisocial, like awkward nerds or like people who are nervous. I'm sure she's like used to it. Right, guys? Corp. Right, guys? Right, guys? Sure, sure, cool. No, bro, no! By the way, I'm very happy we've not died. I was thinking, what if we lost these 18,000? It would be, I may as well just start again. If we, are, genuinely, if I lost, if I died and lost these souls, it probably would be better to start again. No, no joke. Probably be quicker. If you're just coming in now, I have to farm 20,000 souls for this tower key. I have, to, I have to get the tower key right now. Boom, boom. Operation Distract Lenny. No, oh, that's 100 souls. They dropped them and it's 100 souls. I just sold one before. Cool. I think it's actually... Get, killing those five is probably quicker than going around to the rest of them. I could... Okay. There's something else I want to say. Okay, one more thing I want to say on this grind. It's interesting. It's an interesting conversation. And it's that this is... If, you, if you're just joining in now, our build, confirmed, is yet again the bow. Yet again another bow build. And it makes a lot of us wonder, like, why are IGN so fond of the bow? And the way I see it is that they must know that how powerful... Like, obviously, if you wanted to do, like... We know that, you know, in modern days, if you want to, if you did want to do a ranged character on Dark Souls, you'd usually do magic, because it's very, very fucking strong. But the thing is, like, IGN probably know about magic, but they think about it much differently. I think the way that IGN thinks about the bow is that it's not gated by like, MP, or it's not gated by a spell charge. They just probably see the value of having, like, 99 shots. And they see that as a much more valuable commodity than having a, like a really powerful attack. Do you see what I mean? Can I get the silver cat ring from the tree jump? Oh yeah, like IGN knows about the tree jump. Nice one. <laughs> That's the way I see it at least. I mean, they IGN probably does know how powerful magic is. It probably does. But it sees the value of having 999 arrows and not having to like, manage and conserve like magic resources. It sees that as way more valuable, as it's more like, you know. In all fairness, boys, we're coming up to the end of the farm. That's 550 souls there. We're still, actually, I think we're only about another five more goes around. I have enough, so actually, how many of, how many of these do I have? I only have one of those. Okay. No, no, no. I, I, I'm, I'm still a bit short. I'm, I, I, the chime's 100, so I need to get another 400. Another 400, guys. 400. 400 and we're done. <sighs> Thankfully, these guys dropping things like souls has been really handy. That's actually made a nice difference. Every soul is, is the same as two kills. So it all adds up. I'll take them. 
My favorite part when he drops the paper says, look at this dude. <laughs> oh, at the start, yeah. I like that bit too. Right. Well, we're coming up to the end of our grind now. And we are an hour in. I'm very sorry for the people watching this live. Hey, people watching the video, you don't have to see this shit. People are here live, I have to sit here watching this shit for an hour. I think it's another 200 souls. Thank you for the sub there. It's Aki. Yeah, boy. Thank you, man. I'm sorry if it's been a bit boring. I'm sorry if it's not what you hoped it would be, but I do it by... I'm so... Guys, I'm sorry if it's not entertaining. I do it by the fucking letter, though, boys. I do it by... I do what the fucking guy says. I don't give a fuck. There's actually, it's, 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 it's different how these guides are. Oh shit, that's a loot box and a half there. 100, wait, is that enough? I think we have enough. I think we have enough. Hang on. We do. We have it. We have it. We are out. We are out, see boys. Let's continue. With the guide, finally, guys, the guide's back. The guide's back. And we can continue the dance. You only have an hour. Sell the item. Sell what I don't need. I do not need these two chimes. That is 20,000 souls. I'm your stinky boy, so xylate. I might be the first person who's uh, ever done this. <laughs> Actually, no, fuck, what am I saying? I did have done this, obviously. The Shrine Handmaiden sells a tower key for 20,000 souls. Oh. I would just love to level health like 25 right now, you kidding me? Once you obtained the 20,000 souls by the tower key ASAP, you can now explore the other part for some particularly devilish rewards. <sighs> Do you ever get that feeling of deja vu? Do you remember, Do you remember getting 20,000 souls for the Crest of Artorias? <laughs> IGN, mate. Why can't I just level health to like 25, you fucking dickhead? Well, time for the devilish rewards. What have we got here? Can't wait for Lenny to Ooh. employed by IGN. Ooh, the Estus ring. Oh, fuck it. That's, I like that ring. And the Firekeeper robes. Oh, okay. Let's get those first. You promote, you be promoted to devilish gamer. Over a thousand viewers, no shot. Do we have so many? It's probably because we finished that shit grind. All right, well, hey, for the people just tuning in now, I've just been told we've got over a thousand viewers. That's crazy. What? Am I still at the tutorial? Yeah, we've not left the tutorial. It's been, it's been, forty-four minutes. Cause I am the first person in the world to get <laughs> I seriously must be the first person in the world to get this item I'm gonna give her this before we even leave she's gonna be like oh see you later Tarnish what, what the fuck where'd you get that from <laughs> right but it says to get the it says to get the um devilish reward Estus ring and the firekeeper robes are two fantastic pieces of equipment the ring allows your S to heal even more, while the robes give you some of the best defensive stats we've seen for light armor. Is that true? I don't know. Maybe we can fact check that. And yes, even though these robes are of... Wait, sorry. It's, it's sometimes to do typos. And yes, even though these robes... Oh, fuck, this is a typo. It's written bad. And yes, even though these are robes of the female firekeepers, you can equip these robes even if you're a dude. If you've got a problem with that, grow up. If you've got a problem with that, grow up. Guys, actually true though. I almost bit. Did I, can I still get it? Oh. Fair enough. Based. <laughs> okay. Guys, I'm struggling. Do I have to make a new character? <laughs> Guys, no, no, no. People are saying, you're struggling, Lenny. Make a new character. 
Guys, I do not want to farm <laughs> 20,000 souls again. I'm not making a new character. <laughs> oh, am I playing? Oh, wait, I'm playing FIFA? God, what do you mean FIFA time? What do you mean FIFA time? Guys, we'll cut to the video, guys. I'll, I'll do it as an edit in the video. We'll do it as a, it'll be a funny edit. Guys, we're farming content. I'll edit it. I'll edit it in the video. We'll be a good. It'll be a good edit in the video. We're not doing it live, G guys. I have to go downstairs, get the PS5, and hook it up on the capture card. I can't be asked. <laughs> FIFA stream. <laughs> this doesn't sound like a content doer. Guys, okay, okay. I actually, you know, you guys know I'm up for a bit of banter. Thing is, though, I've been here. I've been, I've been in the tutorial. I've been in the tutorial for one hour. I just want to get going. I, I just want to get going. Okay, there's the Estus ring. There's the Estus ring. Put it on. Anything else here? Exploring further gives you the Firekeeper Soul. And, um... Oh, okay. Exploring further gives you the Firekeeper Soul. Yeah, okay, well, let's go give it to her. Cool. As I said, I think this is so funny. This might be the earliest the Firekeeper has ever received the soul. She's like, oh, see you later, Tarnish. Oh, what? what? Oh, where'd you get that? Bro. No, Estus Shard. I haven't said anything about that yet, but I'm assuming it's going to go, please say the silver cat ring, or please. The silver cat ring is the only saving grace for reclaiming those 20,000 souls. Please say the pick it up. Right. Okay. Firekeeper soul. Uh, we're not, oh my God. Uh, we're not quite sure the purpose of the firekeeper soul yet, <laughs> but giving it to the firekeeper seems to make her pretty happy. She seems she's fucking buzzing for this. She's buzzing for it. Next page. If your quest was to make the fire keep... If your quest was to make your firekeeper girlfriend happy, then consider your game complete. Your quest is over. Is the guide over? Are we done? It was that all... <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, that's the IGN stream. We did it, boys. The, G the girlfriend's happy. She's got a fuck. She's got a fire. She's buzzing. <laughs> GG. It's over. Nah. Last but so oh, thank the fucking Lord. Last but certainly not least is an additional Esther's shard and a silver covetous ring, which boosts our soul gain from every single enemy we fell. Hopefully, you're starting to see our logic as to why we did this so early. Oh my god. It's it's so IGN though, right? Do you remember in IGN Dark Souls 1 where we spent we spent 40,000 souls to gain 40,000 souls? IGN, I, that's the main thing I've noticed with them. They love just trying to get those pure even splits. They're not looking to make profits. They're not looking to like make a huge investment. They're looking just to scrape on by. They're, yep. Trade off 20,000 souls. You see our logic. This, and thankfully, also getting the silver covetous ring. And obviously, these things here. Nothing about Snuggly the Crow, though. Nothing, I saw nothing about Snuggly the Crow. Nothing about Snuggly the Crow. Boom, boom. Okay. There's the silver. <laughs> Covetous ring. Japan will help us reclaim. And I just go to say further. The sooner we get this ring, the sooner we can start reclaiming those 20,000 souls. Don't worry. We'll have them back soon. That's an IGN promise. An IGN promise about it's, it's worth its weight in shit, mate. And I, what do you mean that's an IGN promise? It's worth its weight in shit, mate. Page eight, boys. Get your textbooks open. We're actually starting the fucking game now. Let's fucking go for it. Oh, guys, do you trust? Okay, before I can only I can only continue this run. Listen, I'm 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 just gonna stand there. No, fuck it. I'm not starting the run. I'm not starting to the run until you all agree. IGN has a great promise, right? Guys, you believe the IGN promise, don't you? You trust, yeah, you do, come on. Let's go, the High Wall of Lothric. 
Yeah, I, yeah, come on, guys. You guys get it. Don't stop saying FIFA time. We're done with that. Right. Okay, open the door ahead. Boom. Bam. The true Dark Souls starts here. As Souls players like to say at the entrance of every new location. The fuck does that mean? The true Dark Souls... The true Dark Souls starts here. Do we say that? The true Dark Souls starts here. As Souls players like to say. Do we say that? We do now! We- at the start- oh, the true Dark Souls starts here, boys! The true Dark Souls starts here! Yeah, I say that every day. <laughs> we do now! <laughs> Alright, there's only one uh, there's only one path forward. Open the doors, yep, 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 yep. There are two paths, one with a dragon to the left and one- Oh, okay, it's getting waffly now. The main path is the on the left, but first go to the right to grab some very useful items. Yeah, it's all just what I like to call waffle. The very kind of enemy here, kill the enemy, pick up the item. First look at the little gap in the wall, opposite the side of the dragon. You'll pass through and aggro the crossbowman. You can dispatch him and save him the trouble of hitting you when you are below. Don't fall off the edge. Make sure you make some noise on the ledge so you may pull one dog from below so you can take him out 1v1. Then take the stairs down and aggro the second dog. So it's just a kind of waffle, waffle, you know, this is it, this is it, this is the enemy here. Kill the enemy. Go, go, there's another one. You know what, I don't need to read all the waffle. You've I, got to say it at the start of every area now. Are we saying at the start of every... Guys, at the start, every time there's a named area, we have to say it, right? I want, I want in the video, it will, it would look great for the video if everyone spammed it. At the start of every area, you guys, we have, we have to say it. We have to say it. It'll look great for the video. Got it, boss. The true, what does that mean? The true Dark Souls starts here. The true Dark Souls experience starts here, what I say every morning when I get up for work. I mean... Where you, The true Dark Souls starts here! I'm sorry, I'm absolutely perplexed! By the way, look at this. 33 souls. Out of the oh, way, fuck. We boot Serious spicy boy coming through. Let's fucking go, boys! Thank you for the 10 subs there, Spanky the Clown. That's a great name. Spanky the Clown. Oh, it said to get the Esther Shard, yeah, but it said that the Esther Shard can be brought to the blacksmith. And I just forgot to do it. I'm free to do that on my own. Thank you for the 10 there, Spanky. How are you doing, man? Thank you. Oh, the true Dark Souls starts here, guys. I don't know what that means. I'm not going to figure it out, but hey, a very important item ahead. Hostile grunts around the area who are otherwise wait in ambush. All in all, at a measly of 36 souls each, it's best to leave them alone. What do you mean a measly 60? What do you mean a measly 36 souls? I farmed 20,000 20 ago. <sighs> okay. We're all good here. Oh, here we go. Yep, up the ledge here. Um. Oh, it's talking about... It calls this guy a snake beast. I'm going to get this guy with the boy now, actually. Fuck it. Nice. Really glad I made it to the start oh. of the real Dark Souls. Zero and six. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean, bro? No! <laughs> I really hope, you know, how people start saying float down. I really hope people start saying that now. It's nice. All right. Um. Okay, immediate retreat. Oh, before the snake beast attacks you. I think that's the guy. It means the big guy over there. Watch out for his attacks. Uh, the monster does not like it if you leave the top of the tower. So if things go badly, you can always flee. Then give it a smack from behind. If lured all the way down the stairs, it may get stuck. Four months of floating down. If lured down the stairs, it may the get stuck. Souls was the friends we made along the oh, way. that's the closest I've seen to that joke being what it is. The true Hellgate <laughs> London starts here. <laughs> Guys, die. <laughs> it's saying to cheese the sky by luring him down the stairs and getting him stuck. Or I could just do that. Um. Ooh. If the tower is complete, then collect a longbow and 12 standard arrows. A very nice upgrade for later. Head on back. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. Okay. 
Restart. Guys, don't make me restart. Don't. Please don't make me restart. <laughs> I guess I'm putting the longboat. It's not an upgrade, Igen. IGN, it's not an upgrade. <sighs> okay. From the bonfire, go towards the Grey Dragon. It won't attack you. Yep, 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 yep. Safest way. Yeah, it's just saying go around. Um, treat up the stairs on the left-hand side. When the overseer calls the alarm, the grunt ahead of lands. Yeah, it's just normal waffle, waffle, waffle. Yeah, pa get up the two gold pa Oh, okay. I, I like this thing as well. It, go, it says to go get the, the gold pan resin up here, which I always do my speed runs. Waffle, you say? And the reason why I say waffle, what these IGN guides do a lot is a lot of stuff like, oh, uh, go to the top, kill this enemy. After killing that enemy, there'll be two more behind you. Go pick up the item. Now, when the item's picked up, go back down the previous path and pick up those two items. It's like a lot of kind of like, blah, blah, blah. It's just like, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't really, um, you know, that kind of stuff. I kind of just skip out. Well, don't skip, but... Oh, fuck. No, don't die. 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 The true Dark Souls starts here. The true Dark Souls starts here. What? 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 Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, no. No, no. FIFA question? <laughs> Guys, we're not playing anymore FIFA. Why waffle specifically? It's just, it's just what I say, really. Boom, boom, boom. Let's just pick up the binoculars here, too. Oh, oh. Okay, it's okay, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, guys, it's fine, guys, it's fine, it's fine. We're not playing FIFA, we're not playing, we don't have to play FIFA. I'm sorry, I'm just reading the guide. Yeah, it's just click the binoculars, which you used to look around in first person. Go back down to the dragon's level. Yeah, I'll go across that little thing there. The true Dark Souls starts here. <laughs> guys. <laughs> Come on, guys. Pa! The guide wouldn't say that, though, would it? The guide wouldn't say that, though. Why would the guy say that? Oh, pa Pat's here. Pat's here just to fucking piss me off. What are you doing, ladder? Huh? The true Dark Souls starts here. <laughs> Thank you. Alright. Get down here. No, it's, it's, it's just the true Dark Soul. Singular. Okay, seriously though, guys. What do you think that even means? It's just the true Dark Soul. Singular. I'm trying to think, like... Is it trying to do that? The true Dark Soul is the friendship we made? That's the... Oh my fucking god, I'm getting battered here. It's a message in Demon Souls? It's not, is it? Is it? Thank you, Mr. Sal, for giving this up. Guys, I'm not struggling. I'm fine. I'm fine. I don't know what he's trying to mean. The writer's kill. All right, let's just, let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. Boom. Bam. Down here. I'm excited to get to our first boss. I don't know why I said that because I really hope it's Vought, but I have a sneaky feeling it might be something else. It was a big Demon Souls meme? Really? It was? I don't know Demon Souls stuff. What was it? Seriously, what is it like Was it like a message or something? Huh. The right, right, yeah, way back when. Huh. I think it's a message. Ah, oh, shit, okay. I genuinely didn't know that. Fair play to them. Right, I'm gonna go back, level up, and give, turn in these Estus flasks. I'm turning in these Estus flasks. Oh my God, just change, okay. Just turn the page, I've seen something. I've seen some of guys. I'm gonna wait till we get back to show you guys. Ah. Oh, I wish I could talk. I, I fucking wish I could talk to Sweet Shao Kwa. She's not fucking here. I'm, can I buy arrows? Oh, fucking get in. Wooden arrows. 
Uh, reinforce the longbow, probably. And reinforce Estus, yep. Oh, the firekeeper saw! Oh, fuck, I forgot about that. Yeah, put this on. Thanks for reminding me. Why well, look great? Oh my god, this looks fucking sick. Welcome. This looks fucking sick. Okay, I've got enough dicks to the boy now. Yeah, grow up. Yeah. Okay. Actually, I should try and buy some arrows. I want to start using the bow. So let's try and buy some arrows. How many can I buy? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, no, okay, let's do that. That's nice and cheap. Let's just do that. Oh my god, this trip's sick. All right. Oh, I can grab the Titanite Shard in the corner of this area. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Titanite Shard in the corner. I think I already picked it up. Yeah, I did. Okay. All right, but as you admit, I am fucking dripped out with the bow and the armor. That's sick. And now it's time to tell you guys about something <laughs> I've just seen in the guide. So, you know, a lot of people say, you know, hey, like, uh, wait, I'm just going to get into a nice view because it says here, there's a fine view of the dragon from up here, but sniping is strongly discouraged. Wow. Wow, I didn't think they'd do that. I thought they'd have me sniping the dragon. Holy fuck. Seriously, you've got a big stock of soul points. By this point, you may want to go back and spend up the final shrine. No, oh, what the shit? Okay, first of all. Yeah, okay, they've, they've got a meme. They've got a meme. A sweet fire, a sweet fire breathing dragon on the bridge. Yep, this is Dark Souls. Yeah, this is Dark Souls, fucker. We have sweet fire-breathing fucking dragons, bro. Yeah. And secondly, part two, chase after dragon. This is only possible if you have a bow. Climb up the way of the stairs, hide behind the little tower, and shoot the dragon between bursts. You just told me it's discouraged. And now it's like, hold on. Is that a sweet fire-breathing fucking dragon? Kill the dragon. The true Dark Souls starts. <laughs> no, seriously. It says here, this is so weird, at the top there. It's strongly discouraged. And then it says further down, chase off the dragon. Or you put to possibly have a ball. I don't fucking know. I don't have a fucking clue. Does it mean like from... Oh, I've not even act activated the dragon yet. I've not even act. I need to go activate the dragon first. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you guys clearly don't understand the true dance. <laughs> Just bow strong enough. Well, we'll get. Okay, it's talking about it later. I'm just activate the dragon first, and then we'll talk about it. Yeah. It's not mentioned the Mimic, by the way. A lot of people think you might get the Mimic. Okay, back over here. I kind of want to kill the big Silver Knight. There he is. Bom bom. Yeah, I thought that the Mimic's a good starting weapon for sure. Oh, fuck. I thought they'd mentioned that. Okay. Well, we're here now, and... <laughs> I don't know, maybe there's a bit of, there was a few arguments breaking out in the IGN office break room, but yeah. Climb up part of the stairs and the upper path. Drop down to the wooden platform by its side. Oh, it means the one all the way down there. Fire between bursts, pop out and ping the dragon in its closest part of the wing. You can't kill it, but eventually it will fly away. You'll score a large Titanite shard for your trouble. With a dexterity of 90, how do you have 19 decks? We have a deck score of 19 and wooden arrows. The cheapest one you can buy. About 60 arrows. Okay, 60 is not bad. 60 not, okay, okay, okay. 60 is not bad. We have we have more than that. We have more than that. Oh, fuck this. I have to kill these guys. Maybe they spent their fucking 20k on decks. I don't know, boys. 
tell you what, actually, tell you what. This is the thing about the ball build. Every time I'm using the mega, hey. I like the ball build. Oh, stamina. Nice. That was ready for 600. Well, you can, you can, in this game, you can only carry a max of 99 arrows. So they can't do these, these cr incredibly big stocks anymore. Oh, fuck. I need to kill the crossbow guy first. Okay. Big nerf. <laughs> okay. Well, it, I think it says to... I have to kill a dragon from up here. Get behind him. Yeah. Nice. Right. So it said I go up the stairs and down this on this little perch here. They pop in and out of getting shots. And I go like here. Can I shoot this part? Oh my fucking god. <sighs> well. If you weren't sure you were watching IGN, you sure fucking know now. If you were if you if you weren't sure this was an IGN video, you fucking know now, boys. This is so them though. Is it bad that this is my first one too? Nah! I can see why people do it, but she's like. <sighs> okay. Peak IGN. When's he gonna fly away? What's better? This is the tower grind. <laughs> the tower grind was an hour. What about these other arrows? Good damage? Hmm, number 10. Is he gonna go? Is he gonna go? By the way, I've never done this before. I've never done this before. I don't know what happens. About 5% health. Cool. You can see why people do it, but it's not ideal stream content. I don't know what the guy says. I don't give a fuck what you guys think. I always do. Why do you guys do this? Do you get souls? Or is it for the large Titanite? <laughs> yeah, I'm, the damage isn't even that bad, honestly. You get zero souls. He's not flying away. Come on. You s is Wait, bro. Is that a sweet fire-breathing dragon on the bridge? Is he gone? I've never done this before. I don't know what the fuck happens. Oh. 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 Fuck off. Monkey on the car. Fuck off. Yep. Afterwards. Loot the bridge. Large soul of deserted cops. Claymore. Ember. And then any other random loot dropped by the guys. Okay. Well, honestly, our bow's doing okay damage. Happy with the bow. Might be able to kill Vault with it. Yep, yep. Next page. Bo -bo -bo. Yeah, it's talking about going from that, uh, the tower wall bonfire. Heading down one level, re-enter the tower. Yep. Cool. cool. I like how it... it, it I, what I lo like about these guides all the time is... Uh, it gives the, like, NPCs certain different names. For example, it calls the Put of Men. You know, those big black, uh, like, mon like big, crazy, like, I don't know what to call them. I was going to call them a snake, because that's, that's, that's what the guy calls them. He calls them snake beasts. They're called snake beasts. Right. Go on here, pick this up. Uh, yeah. Nice. Bum bum bum. Anything else following me? No, nothing's following me. Oh, fuck off! Pop his trim off! Get this. Oh, fucking hell. This is sick. Oh my god. You know, guys, say what you want. The ball build fucking. It does numbers. Right. Another ball build, yeah, who'd have guessed? Past this area is another snake beast. If you're far enough away, it won't aggro. And if it does, good luck. <laughs> oh, shit. It says to go down, get the crystal beast. So get, get the crystal lizard. Go down, get the crystal lizard. Then go back up and cheese it with arrows. 
So it's like, get this guy for the raw gem. And then it goes, go back up to the platform you were at before. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Whoa. And cheese it with arrows. It says the term cheese. It's been saying cheese a few times. The really embrace. Did it fall off a cliff? <sighs> cheese. Cheese, guys. We've got cheese. Cheesed it. There we go. There's actually, when, when, when I'm reading this guide, it says the term cheese a lot. Yeah, like here, there's a knight patrolling the, the rooms ahead. If you take one step in, you can take him out with your confident, or you can cheese him with arrows. Just pick him once, climb the ladder all the way to the top. You'll know when he gives up when he thumps his spin the ground, rinse and repeat. It's saying, it's like really embracing. This is what, this is what I was talking about before. Their self-awareness. They're starting to be able to go onto fucking YouTube and find cheesy guy number fucking 12. You know what I mean? IGN Italian division. <laughs> you know these guys? So it's saying I can go here and cheese this guy wherever he is. Where is he? Pick him with an arrow. Decent-ish damage. Then I just run up here. And it says you'll know when he gives up when he thuds his spear on the ground. Can you eat fucking... Well, I heard it. Oh, he's just going back. Huh. Yeah, I heard the thud. Oh. Fucking hell. Is this what I'm doing in my IGN play? Is this seriously... <laughs> What the IGN playthrough's gonna be? This shit! Wait for the thud, guys! The true Dark Souls starts here! There it is! Oh, wait, I, I think he saw that one. He saw that one, shit. I should've waited more. Fuck. Oh, no! How did I miss that? Shut up. Try to get headshots. Nice. <laughs> All right, well, I'm doing this a bit more. Yeah, but a lot it's got a lot of this kind of shit. Like, oh, get, cheese the boss, cheese the boss. No, it's like, cheese the enemies. It's saying to go in here, Esther Shard Head. Very precious. Extra, extra swig. And uh, two tall guys. Oh, get the key from the corpse, yep. Can I get two? Shit. Get up. Cheesy end boss. I wish. I fucking wish. Pros raging. Imagine you're a silver Lothric knight who's trained thousands of years in the undying curse. This fucking dipshit comes on. <laughs> that pings you narrow. <laughs> God damn it, man. Shit. Lost to a ladder. <laughs> <sighs> Man. It's taking some time. They don't teach you this shit at night school, bitch. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, fuck, I almost fell. Oh, shit! Get fucked! What's this? That's a good-ass weapon! We're just gonna fucking use it. I'm using the bow. Yeah, it's saying to get the uh, shard on the key. Oh, I can do some more cheeseburgering. Uh, yeah, oh, fuck. Oh. We're good, we're good. I can't get these guys. How do I do this shit? I'll get the dog. Fuck the dog. I'll get the dog. Nice. <laughs> Where the fuck are you going, bro? Hey! What? Where is he going? Guys, he's actually kind of scared me. Where's he going? <laughs> he kind of ran off like, fuck, man. <laughs> He's running for it. Right, let's just get the, let's get the stuff. 
And the key. And the key. I'm happy to die here, I don't give a fuck. But if I make it, I make it. Boom. Down hit. Bomb bam. Oh no, 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 no. Uh oh, fuck. Oh shit, am I gonna die? No! Let's go back up, let's go back up the ladder here. Let's go back up the ladder, we'll be good. We'll be good up the ladder. We're getting close to our first boss, guys. Excited. Oh, shit. Getting close to our first boss, guys. Wait, can I go up? Can, oh, those guys can go up the ladders. You never said why I like spears so much. In Dark Souls, spears are my favorite weapons. It's because, um, because of the, it's weapon reach. You can physically press your R1 button, like, half a second earlier than your opponent. So, therefore, you beat them to the punch every time. If they and enemies that stagger, spears are so good. Where's cat meme? Oh, all right. Oh, we're getting close. Bomb. Bom. Yeah. But down here, what else we got? Next page. Hulking night area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where I am now. Yeah, it's all good. Oh, it's just saying, yeah, you can take him out if you want. But, you know, feel free to go ahead. Ooh. It's saying to go see the Emma, High Priest of Lothic, for the banner. So it looks like we're, it says to go get the banner from um, Emma. So it looks like we are. A lot of people thought we were doing Dancer. Guys, do you not remember the IGN Promise? The IGN Promise, boys. The IGN Promise, do you not remember? Get the banner. IGN wouldn't lie, right? Here we go. Lothric banner. Happy with that shit? Okay. Um, yeah, NPC in the chair. Ember the High Priest of Lothric will give you the small Lothric banner. We're going to return here later. Yep, fair enough. Next up, unlock the shortcut. Okay, unlock the shortcut. Cool, cool, cool. Nice to see you're doing well, Lenny. I'm doing all right, thank you. I'm doing all right. Thanks for the subs, by the way. We had a bunch of subs there. Thank you. Every single one. Thank you. Unlock the shortcut. Of course I remember Ijin's promise. Word is bond. <laughs> okay, well. I don't... I never use a shortcut up here. Do you guys use a shortcut? It's not mentioned, um... Hang on, what's it saying about... Someone mentioned Red Eyes Knight. No, nah, it's not mentioned any sort of Red Eyes Knight. Oh, no, sorry! He, there's a Red Eyes Knight here. Much tougher than the others. But if you, but if you kill him, you get a refined drop. Refined gem drop. Yeah, people say it every time. Oh, shit. I think the shortcut's kind of the same as, like... If you sprint, the shortcut's got kind of... It's not really a shortcut, it's the same kind of distance, do you not know think? I, that's the way I feel about it. Oh, fuck you. I feel like this shortcut is like the kind of the same distance, like six and two threes. It is faster. Oh, hmm. oh shit! Uh, no, it's safer. Hmm, fair enough. Yeah, I, I, I can see that. Hey, Turk, there. Thanks for the five. There. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry, I've, I've, I've got. Uh, we've not got notifications on because I'm for the video. All right, we got the shortcut. Yeah, cool, cool. Now we have our shot bomb. Now we have our bonfire shortcut ready to go. It's time for our first boss. Pussy. Now hold on. Dancer. Of the Boreal Valley. Well. Well, you just knew that was going to happen, didn't you? But hang on! Hang on, boys, because I have read a little bit further ahead. It is the Dancer of the Boreal Valley, but... Dancer of the Boreal Valley. Cheese edition. First up, go back to Firelink Shrine and buy 300 to 500 arrows! 
Yep, yeah, I'll buy 300, fuck it. How many can I get? How many have I got? How many have I got? Well, I can, I can already carry that. I can already carry 99. Unfortunately for us, however, you can only carry a max of 99 arrows. Dark Souls 3 finally understands how strong the bow is and has tried to quell its power with this nerf. Luckily for you, you have us and we have a workaround. Take the eye. Oh my God. Guys, I've got. No, 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 no. Before we go any further, I've, we've got a proposition from IGN. This starts our first major boss. Take the IGN challenge. Can you beat the game quicker than us? We have beaten the game with an in game time of 68 hours. <laughs> <laughs> Take the IGN challenge, guys. Can you beat this game in 68 hours? You know those fucking cringe videos? Can, can you beat uh, Dark Souls with faith only? No, can you beat Dark Souls in 68 hours? Take the IGN challenge, bro. Well, they have a workaround. Next page, next page. Firstly, go back to Emma and kill her in any lovely way your crude heart desires. This will... Guys, can we beat this in 48? Oh shit, I'm here. Uh, oh, I'll just, I'll just run from here. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> 69 or restart. <laughs> Look at my casual play. For 53 hours. All DLC, your move, IGN. I don't know, man. <sighs> Guys, I don't like the look of this. Yeah, no, it, it, it said cheese edition. It said cheese edition, but I'm scared, bro. It says to go over to it. Look at my health bar. Right. It's okay. It's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It doesn't bother me. It bothers me immensely. Fuck. If I get... I don't want to get one shot. Have I even leveled? Don't think so. But hey... <laughs> It is Boreal Valley time. Kill Emma in any lovely way your crude heart desires. Fuck, I'm, if I'm doing this, I may as well have some a bit of fun. Fuck this love. What do you think of this love, eh? Hang on, what do you, what, what, what you think of this love, eh? Shit. Hang on, before I, I want to read ahead before I kill her. No, <laughs> she's got those arrows in her eye, right? This will trigger our boss. As soon as your cutscene ends, open up your menu and quit out to the title. What are they cooking? Upon reloading, you should be outside the boss room. This is where our first piece of prep work happens. Walk as close as you can to the fog wall without entering and drop a maximum stack of arrows. No! The cut the dropping arrows to run to I'm killing her, fuck it. I need to save him. I need to save my I need to save my arrows. I need to save my arrows. Right, quit out. Quit out. Quit out. People are saying I've not seen the Yumfer. Is that, did Yumfa do this in the video? Has Yumfa done this in the video? I've not seen Yum. I've not seen his video. I've not seen his video. Honestly, it doesn't surprise me. It doesn't surprise me that these things kind of can take a bit from here, here or there. Okay, so I have to drop a ma as many arrows as I can. Oh, fuck, how many can... Oh, I've got, okay, I'll drop these. That, okay, 92. And backlogs too. Okay, okay, okay. Here, well, I, I don't know what they're doing. Well, I do. I think I know what they're doing. Here's the hard part. <laughs> Run back to the bonfire through our recently unlocked shortcut without dying or quitting out. Dying or quitting out will despawn the arrows. 
if you manage to buy a good stack, if you manage to buy a greater stack of arrows, you have a greater margin for error here. Once back at the bonfire, quickly use the bonfire and dead, but don't quit out. Replenish your arrow stock and run all the way back to the cathedral. I am genuinely, it's, it's genuinely ask. <laughs> okay. So I need to do this deathless. But th this is the problem I have right now. Uh, okay, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Problem I have right now is that I just have more arrows. I just have more. I still have to fucking kill the bastard. I still have to kill the fucking thing. That's the problem. Shit, no, 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 please. How many arrows? I have 300 in storage. 300 arrows in storage. Okay, 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 we're good. Don't you need five? It said 300 to 500. Oh shit, I can't sit down. Okay. Okay, so now I don't quit out to the menu, and now I have to make it back deathless without quitting out. Now run all the way back to the cathedral, only this time feel free to kill whatever body necessary along the way, as they won't be respawning now. Outside the cathedral can take two nights at the front. Okay, okay, okay. I think I'll, I'll just do, I'll do a, mm, shit. I need to get rid of, okay, I need to kill, I can, okay, I can see why they've asked me to get loads of arrows. Cause it's not like I need, maybe I don't need that many arrows. Cause the bow, I thought the bow was doing half decent damage, no. I thought the bow was doing half decent damage. Maybe it's just like, in it's my, they said for a greater margin of error, maybe it's just in case we fuck up more. You know what I mean? <sighs> boom, boom, boom. Okay. Have I killed Vort? No, I've not. This is our first boss. And we are... T Guys, we're taking the IGN challenge. Oh, you can see why they've taken 86, 68 hours. They're farming 20k souls. Right, I need to get these guys. Oh, wait, I can't waste my arrows. What the fuck am I doing? I can't waste my arrows. I don't want to waste my arrows. Fuck, I need those. Um. No. 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 Oh. oh, I hate that move. I suck. I suck against these guys. By the way. Oh no! 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 Oh, please don't fuck this up. Uh. Oh, I thought I was a backstab there. Oh, no, no, no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to die to this guy. I'm going to die to this guy. Fuck. Nice. Okay, 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 okay. We're good. We're good. We're fine. 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 This guy now. I'll try and get the backstab. Let's try and get the backstab. He turns around, hopefully. He said to clear out these knights. Didn't see me? Didn't see me? Did you not see me? Can I walk? Can I do an edgy RP walk? Fuck it. Oh no, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, I should have. Ah, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, the Great Shield ones are scary, yeah, I know, right? Well, that's all my Estus gone. No. Guys, I don't have any Estus for the fucking actual fight. Well, I have no Estus left. Hopefully, I don't fucking need any Estus. Take this off. Right. Well, there's my arrow. Okay, okay. There's, there's my arrows. And there's Dancer through the fucking thing. Okay. Outside the cathedral, let's take out the two knights. Now it's time for part two.
Ah, ah, got. Now it's time for part two, courtesy of the Dark Souls subreddit. Ah, this is the Dark Souls. So these guys are a bunch of fucking redditors. Yeah. Line yourself up dead center with the boss fog wall. Oh, what the? Oh, it's not shooting through the fog, is it? Slowly tap forward on your control stick or keyboard until you hit the very edge of the enter boss room fog gate prompt. Enter the boss room and hit backdash as fast as you can. If done correctly, you should be inside the boss room without the boss, without the boss aggroing. You can then take out, you can then take out your longbow or ranged weapon of choice and fire away. With, with the extra stack of arrows on the ground, you should have enough to take out its entire health bar. Wait. Oh, guys, it's not patched, right? So it said to go. So, like. Oh, wait. No, I don't want to pick up. Forward. Forward. No, I still. Forward. Guys, this is just like the fucking Sif strat. I can't be fucking arsed, right? No, 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 no. It's fine. It's fine. Traverse fog? Then it says. So I'm trying to follow it here. I'm trying to follow it here. Then hit back dash button as fast as you can. No. No, 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 I don't want to panic. No, no, no! No, no! No! No, there's no way! There's no way! No. <laughs> no! Come on! <laughs> Look at this cook going in for the fight! Look at that cook going in for a fight! Do I have enough arrows? Well, they did say it was IGN. It was Boil, it was Dancer, Cheese Edition. It was Cheese Edition right here. It was the Cheese Edition. And I think they've got this one spot on. They've got this one spot on. Yeah, it just says fire away. The extra stack of arrows on the ground should be enough to take out some... Can you use the weapon art? Well, I didn't mention, but I guess so. You need 127 arrows. Oh, so it actually did make a difference dropping that stack? I didn't know about, I've not watched it. Some people in chat have been saying, oh, Yampa did this and like Backlog did this. I, I haven't watched them, those videos. I genuinely didn't know. What about phase two? What about phase two? Oh, fuck. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down, love. Don't aggro. Oh, I'm doing less damage. That's an IGN promise. Guys. Oh, is that phase two? Off. Oh, I, I hope the boss doesn't go further back. I'm gonna use this cheese. Is my bow gonna break? No, the durability's fine. I can, I can see it from here. Yeah, it's the, it's the distance for sure. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. <sighs> the true Dark Souls starts here. Fuck's sake. Need that hawk ring. Can someone come drop me a hawk ring, please? <laughs> Gavpon, thanks for the sub there, man. Well, we're at 50 arrows, and the boss still has quite a healthy health bar. Well, it still has over half health. So it does seem like these arrows that I dropped will make a difference. I have been, actually, I have been playing Lies P here on Twitch. 
I have been playing it. I've been really enjoying it. So I mentioned it before, but it's really for the better vault bonfire, right? <laughs> I don't believe this, man. Thanks for the donations there. Uh, sorry, I've, I've got the... Maybe I can re-enable... I'll re-enable the alerts because it's been... A, a, you know, things have calmed down a bit more. I'll re-enable my... Uh, stuff. Thanks for that! Did would you? Thanks for that, man. Appreciate that. Um, uh, oh, fuck's sake. I, I tabbed out for one bit. There we go. Oh fuck! I don't. Okay, I don't like it when it does that because it goes further away. I'm doing less damage. Okay, I should do a bit more damage now. Guys, we're two hours in. I don't fucking believe this. Thing is, I'm gonna start running out of arrows now. Actually, okay, now we've had a bit of time here. What do you think? What do you think about the guide so far? What do you think about the guide so far? Do you like it so far? They're cooking. Very good guide. Very good guide. Amazing. <laughs> Are they taking the Kingdom style? What I expected, to be honest. Again, okay, it does raise a very. Uh, this is this is another thing. It's, 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 I'm going to put this bit in the video. Fuck it. It does raise a very... It, okay, no, no, no. Actually, I'll do it now. So as you can see in the bottom left, I'm running out of arrows. I haven't got enough to kill the boss bar. Just now I go. <laughs> do I... <laughs> I don't fucking... <laughs> right, Dark Souls 3 understands how OP the bow is. It knows. Fuck me! <laughs> now, <laughs> it, it does raise a very interesting conversation, right? It's like, if you guys have watched the previous IGN videos, you know that they always do these bow strats rather than magic. And it makes a lot of people think, like, why? You know, especially because how much better magic... Oh, fuck. How much better magic is. As far as damage and, you know, viability goes. And honestly, what? They did it in Deep well, It was Demon Souls, Dark Souls, what? A bit in Dark Souls 2 in here. And the way I see it, the reason why IGN loves the ball build so much, in my opinion, it's like this. If you use magic, you have like, what, 10, maybe 20 magic casts? But with a ball, you have 99 shots. And, they, and that's how I see it in my mind. They probably see having 99 shots as a way more viable commodity than having 10 or 20 really powerful shots. That must, that's the only, that's, that must be what the kind of the way to think. And <laughs> 99 is bigger than 20, duh. Well, this boss got fucking cheesed. They said it itself, it was Boreal Dancer Cheese Edition. We're almost there. <laughs> We're almost there, boys. Also, yeah, there's no face too. That surprised me too. Hang on, guys. Hang on. We're almost there. Hang on. Send it. Send it. Ooh. Go on. Go on. Ooh. Ooh. I don't fucking believe- Oh my god, it actually worked! I got the soul and everything! <laughs> the true Dark Souls starts here, boys! Oh my good gracious me, once defeated, you will obtain... The boss bar's not gone away. The music's still there. Phase three? Third phase? Guys, I'm scared. Guys, 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 I'm scared. The game's fighting back. The game's like, oh, wait. Guys, 
eyes, I'm really scared. Guys, I'm scared, guys! I don't like this! I don't like this! IGN, you're fucked in the head, mate! What are you doing? I don't like it. I'm just going to go back here. I'm just going to read further here. Um, right. No, let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're good. All right. And I resume, once defeated, you will be obtaining 60,000 souls. And even more if you took the time to farm up that silver covetous ring. Is this the reason why they did it? It must be. We have not found a better way to start a character online. Feel free to use these souls to make the character of your dreams. Or if you want to stick with us, No, hang on. Hang on, boys. Hang, hang fire. Hang fire. <laughs> or, if you want to stick with us, if you want to stick with our advice, we still have much more to show. With these souls, we will be making the Cheeseburger Mage. <laughs> Why cheeseburger? Because cheeseburgers are better than cheese. Duh. He's fucking right there! Cheeseburger mage! That's me! The cheeseburger mage! It's better than cheese! We level intelligence straight to 30! Everything else on health! Cheeseburger mage! Cheeseburger mage! <gasps> whopper! Uh, did you get out, Gay Lenny? Get that, me Gay Lenny. Get that meme on screen. Did you get a whopper? Whopper! Cheeseburger, cheeseburgers, mate. He's better than the fucking cheesing, bro. Fucking get it in your fucking thick skull, mate. Intelligence to thirty. Intelligence to thirty. Intelligence to thirty. Next page. Whew. All right. Welcome, we're the cheeseburger guys. We're the cheeseburger mage. Intel to thirty. Oh my god. Oh my god. We are kind of cooking. We are kind of cooking. I'll take it. Nothing to kind of use magic with just yet, but. Optionally, before we start our next area. Oh! Yeah, it says you want to be freeing Grey Rat. Okay, cool. Let's get Grey Rat for freedom. We'll go ahead. Guys, the cheeseburger mage! Now, again, this is what I was hoping for. Right. No, no, no. Again, this is what I was hoping for though, right? How I was saying before how IGN thinking of, oh, you have like 99 shots versus 10 magic shots with a mage versus bow, right? But I was thinking, well, in Dark Souls 3, you have the Estus for magic. So effectively, you could maybe get 99 magic shots too. Fire bars, next to the five subs, what the fuck? Thank you. Thank you, man, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate that. Thank you, man. So yeah, I was thinking about it. Like maybe they, with the Estus, uh, with the Ashen Flask, maybe they will do it. You know, because they can now get more, more than just like ten casts. Oh my God, this guy's messing me up. So I was thinking about, hey, they might do it. And yeah, I'm just freeing Grey Rat. Then we get on to our next area. Bum, bum, bum. Anyone follow me? 
Uh, yeah. Yeah. Bum, bam. Agent super on point so far. Yeah, how do you think they're doing? Doing all right. Yep. Cool. Wait. Doesn't doesn't Grey Rat sell arrows? Doesn't 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 he literally sell arrows? He does. So why didn't we do that? Why didn't we do that before Dancer? Rather than dropping the stack. Rather than dropping the stack. Probably too expensive. Hmm. Ah, Jen logic, fair enough. Okay, I don't give a fuck actually. It was way cooler to do it that way. Fuck it, it was way cooler. Are you questioning? Sorry, I forget my guys. I forget my place. Let's go check out his shop first. Oh, sorry. I, I just got with the next page too. Um, what I was gonna do? Oh yeah, Grey Rat. Let's check him out. What you got? What you got? What you got? What have you got here, man? Oh, shit, I am late. Thank you for that, Krozev. Yeah. He does sell standard arrows for 10 a piece. They're really cheap. Didn't have to drop that stack, but I don't give a fuck. It was way cooler. I don't give a shit. It was way cooler doing it like that. I don't give a shit. Let's go. Question hygiene equals freestyle. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It's been a slow start, but we are now booming into the future. Our next boss is not a Cyrus, like some of you guys were saying. It is Vought of the Boyle Valley. This is your actual true first final boss. Do not shit your pants. I was not planning on IGN, but thank you. Thank you. The once knighted, oh, I'll, I'll read it. I'll read it into the, uh, I'll read it when we get there. IGN said, no, it's a don't, it's a don't. Guys, it's a don't. Try out the shit lane. Pants, eagle, unshot. No poopers. No poopers, guys, come on. I have to admit, though, IGN's drip, fucking nice, isn't it? Look at this belter. It's nice. All right. Let's have a bit of a read. The once now hideously transform uh, the once knight has now hideously transformed into a loyal hot dog hound <laughs> of Lothric Vault. Uh, he uses swiping attacks. Oh, it's just normal stuff. He uses swiping attacks to do a quick dash. He'll use uh, the, it to put a quick distance between you and him. If you've got behind him, oh yeah, 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 yeah. You also inflict frostbite. Ah, uh, it's all normal stuff. Nothing too special here. There's a trick to this boss. Um, stay as close as possible. You don't need to get behind him. Just assume the dragon slaying position. I don't know what the dragon slaying position is, but fair enough. How much is my arrows doing? Is this the, is this the, it said assume the dragon slaying position. Fucking hell. I actually, fuck, I actually kind of prefer the, sh the short ball. Because on the short ball, you get access to the roll attack. Wait, if I do this, is he just going to keep edge walking towards me? Is he going to keep edge walking? I think he is. Yeah, it's probably a reference to like kind of like general dragon slaying kind of things, isn't it? Oh, 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 oh. I love this song. Hmm. Another shot. Oh, fuck. Oh, wah, 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 wah. You guys keep edge. Oh shit, he doesn't edge walk in phase two. Shit. Does not edge walk in phase two. Look at that, Dumpy! 
Oh, he does not edge walk in phase two. Shit. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're doing good. No. Oh, yeah. I do have the option of bringing friends. It's said to bring friends if I wanted. Oh, fuck. No way. I was going to heal to be safe. Bomb. Bam. Oh, let's get a 360 finish. You love to fucking see it. You really do. You really do. That's it. When Vault is down, receive his soul. Don't cash it in for currency. You'll have the chance to swap it in for something more precious later. Yep, yep. Go down, light, light the bonfire and raise the banner. Boom. Nice, nice, nice. Well, we'll make... Okay, it was a very slow... Guys, guys, it was a very slow start. But we're making... We're starting to pick it up. I'm quite concerned because it's two hours in. We'll do four... We'll, about half, we'll do four hours a day. We're almost, like, halfway through day one. And we've just got here. It's a bit concerning. But maybe it's why the cheeseburger assassin took the, uh, 68 hours. Who the fuck's that geezer? Piss off. Hey, Lenny, in the video, make it a little kitty cat instead. That'd be a good gag. All right, you did it. Now let's do it all over again. Move a few steps towards the village. Oh, right. You remember that one which my mum played where it was just like a, a, a little short page? It's, just, it's literally just that. <laughs> go up. It just says go up ahead and light the bonfire. The true Dark Souls stuff. Oh, no, guys, yeah. The true Dark... Guys, it's a new area. The true Dark Souls starts here. That's <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Guys, every time people say that, I get more confused. Like, what the fuck's it mean? Guys, <laughs> that's really confusing me. I can't understand why they'd say... Who said... Guys, we say that now, don't we? Right. Next page. The Undead Settlement. The true Dark Souls Dark... Oh, fuck! <laughs> they said it again! They said it again! They said it again! The true Dark Souls starts here! You fuckers! The, are they really going to say that every new area? Are they really saying it? <laughs> okay, sure thing, IGN. Whatever you want to do, baby. Oh, man. We have a laugh, don't we? Oh, fuck, hang on. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Bam, bam, bam. Nice. Okay, let's read ahead. The, as I said, a lot of this is just waffle. What I mean by what I mean by waffle is just kind of the generic. Lanky enemies here are tough. They're just grunts. They occasionally drop fire gems, which is great. Clear two grunts with the cleavers and go along the stalk of the path, leading the head. The third grunt in the long pitch pitchfork is inside, in the barn-like structure. Inside, chop down the corpse and get the small leather shield. With your back to the door, now go to the left-hand side, rolling through the rubble as you do, as you get a hood of the enemy, the assassin. It's a lot of kind of like, here's the enemy, there's the item. Here's, here's the other side. I don't need to read it all like that, you know what I mean? When it gets waffly like this, I'm under the firm assumption, kill everything I see and pick up all the items I see. That's the assumptions I make. Run that by me, but slower. <laughs> guy, I do wonder, should I, should I read ahead and see if the guide actually says the true Dark Souls starts here more than one time? Oh my god, it does. Sorry, sorry, not cheating, sorry. sorry. No, spo no spoilers, no spoilers, no spoilers, sorry. Too late. But I saw, I saw another one. Get this guy. Boom. Alright, yeah. Oh shit. B -b no. Every time they say it, I'm more confused. Like, no, the, re the reason why I'm confused is like, what? It must have come from... No, no, someone said it's from Demon Souls. Someone, someone in my chat told me it's a Demon Souls meme. Where the true Dark Souls or the true thing it starts here. 
If that's the case, fair play. It's an OG kind of joke. No, someone in my chat told me that in Demon Souls, it was one of the default messages with the soapstone. Yeah, it's a message preset. That's so weird. All right, here. It's not all normal stuff here, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get a Loretta's Bone. Yep, I've got that up here. Loretta's Bone here. Yeah, yeah, Evangelist. Luckily, she's not very hard. Pretty easy to intercept. Keeping a good distance. Darting to attack. And the good old arrow, arrow run, rinse, and repeat. Yeah, looks like I'm just killing the Evangelist with arrows here. Yeah, Cookie's right. Sorry, I'm not. Sorry, guys. What I want to say is that um, I've been following, I've been trying to keep up the guide. And keep all the subscriptions. You guys donate, and I really appreciate it. Um, I've not had much time to actually talk to you guys, you know. And usually my streams, I like, I like talking to you guys. I just want to say, you guys have been really cool today. Thanks for being really supportive. So, i tell you what happens sometimes on IGN ones. It pisses me off. Some people want a backseat. I, I fucking... Some people say, Lenny, why don't you farm it this way? I'm like, are you literally backseating a guide? What are you... So, you guys have been real sweet tonight. Really appreciate you guys on some fucking fun behaviour. Yep, we've got all this. For the Esther Shard around here, at the front of the tree, Ember behind it. If you have a boy, he shoot down the corpse in the tree. Yeah, for the Titanite. Ah, oh, cool, cool, cool. Nine cookeries. Like this one here. Boom. Nice. <laughs> Farm FIFA. <laughs> no, bro, no. I'm so glad I didn't play FIFA on stream because I'm play. I, I've been playing before. At the start of the year, there's so many good players. I've been getting my ass kicked on FIFA. It's not. It's not been fun for me. And then get absolutely fucking battered on FIFA. Oh fuck! No. All right. Go go go. Oh. Oh, we're going all the way down to Hodrick. Oh, we're going to all the way down to Hodrick. Ah, okay, cool. Oh, we're fighting Hodrick with arrows. Oh, fuck. Oh. I wonder if I can even kill Hodrick of Arrows. That's going to suck. But I tell you what. Hodrick has infinite... Yeah, actually, can my healing even out damage his... Can my damage can even out damage his heal? That's concerning. Honestly, again. This, this is why I think IGN do the bow thing. Because with magic... What's that? Let's take one shot for that guy. One shot for another guy. And in from the previous room already, you're probably out of magic spells. You probably from the previous room already, you probably your magic's all like worn out. But I've still got eighty fucking hundred odd, odd shots. I can get this fucking thing. No, I can't. Fuck. This is why I feel like they do this. The book, the ball thing. Hello, how are you doing, man? Oh no. Oh wow, I got fucked up there. I'm not fucked up. Hey, Bombing, go nice to see you, man. Yeah, but it's, it's essentially just time to get, get on down to Hodrick. Go, go, go. No, guys, no more FIFA. No more FIFA. Come on, guys. True Dark Souls time. Restart. Oh, bomb. We don't want FIFA. I'm glad you don't. I'm glad you don't. Uh, bop, bop. Actually, isn't this a quick way down to this guy? Down here. I'm off out of the club night. Nice one. Have a nice time. You're a fucking good one. Play play this at the club. It goes hard. <laughs> Shit. Bum, bum, bum. Unfortunately, it, had, it didn't mention the Esther soup and the stuff back there. Oh, wait. This is just the same way. What am I saying? I thought this was like a quicker shortcut, but no, it's just the same way. Bop, 
Bop, bop, bop. About what time did the I just stop making fun guides? I thought like, this this one is a lot more waffly. Usually the other ones have the kind of quirks and the kind of quips a lot more often. This one's a bit slower. This one's very waffly, I gotta admit. Something behind me? Hey, thank you. When does Egg say to play soccer? It's it told us if we're struggling to play a different game and people keep saying <laughs> FIFA. <laughs> right, let's go down here. Let's just do a run. Let's just do a nice little run over. Hey, dear God Farmer, thank you. Thanks all the subs, guys. Thanks all the subs. I really appreciate every single one. I really do. Oh, Lizard! Fuck you, baby! Fuck you, bitch boy! Looking good, Leonard. Thank Hope you. You're having fun. Oh, I'm having the time of my fucking life. All right. Well, we're down to Hodrick here. And for Hodrick, they have quite the street. You may want to pepper Hodrick with a hey, Turkish. Fucking hell! Thanks for the subs, guys. Jeez. Thank you, there, Turkish Dev, for the five gifted subs. Hey, if you got gifted sub there, congrats. All right. You may want to try peppering Hodrick with arrows. As long as his shield is up and he's moving back our way towards strafing. You can very easily hit him with a lock on. Uh, pull him up right next to where you fought the cages and he might get a bit confused. Wait, what the f- Is IGN like- What? Wait, so- Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, is it only happened if, if- Is it only when I'm embered? Is it only if I'm embered? I think it's only if I'm embered, right? I'll ember for it. I don't give a fuck. I didn't notice ember only. Let's get an ember. Well, actually, I'm going to kill this guy first. Man, the bow is fucking nice. Right, ember. But the guide said to pull him up all the way up to where we fought the cages. IGN's like really prodding this game. IGN is prodding this game. Seeing where it's gonna break, you know what I mean? It's... Oh, fucking Hodrick doesn't know what he's in for, mate. Hodrick, you have shot the bed here, mate. I'm sorry, lad. Mate, lock on. Hodrick, mate, you have shot the bed here, lad. I can't hit the bastard. They're really kind of pushing the limits of the game. I I don't think any- I was gonna say I don't think anyone's ever pulled him up this far. Mind you, iGen must have done it before, right? Come on, man. A bit further. Shit. All the way back up here, it said. Where the, we fought these guys. All the way back up here. I don't like those guys being aggro, but whatever. I'm gonna kill these guys. Good, we're good. I thought Hodrick must have caught us by now. Where's Hodrick? He must have caught us by now. Where's Hodrick? Hodrick? What the fuck's he doing? Are you just having a bit of a time out? Oh no, he's coming now. He's like, oh, there he is. There's the bastard. Oh shit, I shouldn't be doing that. Come on, Aldrich. Come on, Aldrich. Oh man, is he really just gonna stay there? Oh no, there he comes. So it's said to pull him all the way back up here. Come on. All the way up here. Oh Jesus Christ. Now what? Oh, fuck. I thought he was going to stay there, though. Shit. Guys, I don't know what the fuck this is. I'm killing this guy. I think I need to free aim this. No, don't, don't. Oh, he just powered it in himself. Oh, fuck. Well, I'm not out damaging that. Oh, good. Um.
I don't think I've ever seen Hodrick all the way up here. This is crazy. No. Oh, well. Okay. This is crazy. No, 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 no! Is he still gonna follow me all the way up here? Fucking hell! How long does this man follow me for? <laughs> Did he try to parry an arrow? The fuck? What is this man doing? No. He's out of Estus. I have to admit, it's kind of working. I'm making him stagger before he can hit me with the sword. It's quite nice, actually. Even if he comes in close, I stagger him if they're bow shot. Like that. Ouch. Nice. I need to heal. Uh oh. No, no, no. Ooh. One more. No way. Come on. I have no idea why they want me to put. Uh, they want me to pull him up here. I have no idea why, but fair fucking play. Okay. It's saying to go do all the um, stuff around here. Down by the bonfire. Cheeseburger, if you please. Yeah, I have to admit it worked. Th this is my question, though. Why pull him that far? This area here is good enough. <laughs> like, I don't know, maybe they were like, hitting him with a bunch of arrows on the way down, you know what I mean? On the way down, they were hitting him with a bunch of arrows too, so I don't know. Okay. Hodrick's down. Yep. Oh, go ahead to the graveyard. Cool. Oh, it's saying to do the graveyard loop. Get the um, S's upgrade there too. Oh, we're going all the way around. We're going up to see the giant and stuff. We're going up to see um, Secret of Katarina. All right. Yeah, maybe they pre-cleared the area. Yeah, probably. Probably that. Let's go see Secret. Oh, but yeah, it's actually, I, I like these kind of moments where, you know, I'm not really uh, focused on the guy too much. I get to talk to you guys instead. Guys, what's been your favorite moment? Oh, what's been your favorite moment so far, guys? What's been your favorite moment so far from the guide? Dancer, obviously. Cheese and mugger. <laughs> the true dinosaurs. It's a lot of good things. When you shot the arrows. Alright, I'll open up this. Going all the way back around. Yeah, go see Sigurd of Katarina, a friendly NPC. Gangnam style top. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> Yeah, honestly, that, that dancer cheese really kind of caught me off guard. That really caught me off guard. That was pretty cool, honestly. Oh, fuck. No, no. Level up ladies. Yeah, I like that too. I like level up ladies too. I kind of prefer that over Souls Waifus. I think it's a better name. Ooh. Oh, no, no. I don't want to die to that fucking dog. Cheese bugger mage. Ooh, it's hot. It's sweaty work, boys. Sweaty work. Okay, okay, now. Oh, I'm being followed. Hopefully, I'm gonna be okay. Fuck! Hey, piss off! Don't do that shit! Cut that shit out, man! What are you doing? Oh, cringe lord. Huh? What the fuck? Um, cheeseburger mage strikes again. Uh, 
It says to go up and see the giant. We can do that. We can do that. Maging so hard right now. We are, bro. We are. Shut up. Scummy tactics. The guy said at the start, if you don't like this cheese strategy, it's not for everyone. It's okay to cheese. Shut up. All right. Um, take the lift up to the giant ahead. We collect the soul in the name of soldier. Um, the giant at the top of here was the one peppering you with arrows before. Time for a bit of payback with our own arrows, methinks. No, 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 God. Guys! Guys, no! Guys, he helps any time! Guys, no, he helps! Cheeseburger! 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 Right in the cock. Honestly. Oh my god, man. The PG-13 show, leave it out. Now. Nah, come on, guys. Hear him out. Hear him out now. C c come on, guys. Nah, come on. Hear him out. Hear him out. He's cooking. He's cooking today. All right, Jen, guys. Cooking today. He's cooking today. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah this is all cool. <laughs> oh, it's saying to go do the uh, demon below. Cool, didn't the demon? All right. You killed my friend. I do as the guide fucking says. Hmm. Hmm, you little stinky bitch. Hmm. Alrighty then. Well, we're here. The secret of Cat Arena is up against quite the pickle here. Let's see if IGN can help him out. An optional boss, a friendly companion, and a sweet stack of loot. Sign me up. Oh, boys! Yeah, there's one thing about me. You know I fucking love epic loot. Where can I find the fucking loot? Have you guys got any loot? Sign me up for some epic fucking loot. Get me that. Sign us up. So you'll find a good Katarina. <laughs> Chat with him. Head on down the rooftop. Optional demon boss. It go Actually, I've just seen this little bit here. It goes on to a list an extensive melee strategy. And then it just says in italics. Or, you know, just use your bow here. So, it's it's trying to accommodate for like other builds, but it's very much like yeah, yeah, we like the ball. Igen likes the ball. What's annoying here is that his plunge attack sends out a huge shockwave of wind and can hit you even if you're far away. So watch out for that. This boss. This boss is a blowout. <laughs> I can't even. Remember. This boss is a blowout. All right, blow it out your ass. Someone's been watching Angry Video Game Nerd. <sighs> that wasn't called for. Wait, can I even hit him? I've got the Hawk Ring. I've got. No, you should have waited. Cheeseburger Mage! The Cheeseburger Mage, guys! Oh, Sigurd's gonna get fucked up here. The Cheeseburger Mage strikes again! This is sick. This is fucking sick. Well, I don't give a fuck. This is working out nice. Look at the Lenny Hamburger emote. That's me. That's me, bro. Hey, people who got a sub, spam that emote. Yeah, no, I, I swear. Yeah, that's that AV Gen line. Someone's been watching a fucking angry video game nerd. Cheeseburger mage, on point. That's another one for the cheeseburger, mage. Oh, a nice bit of sauce. We're quite leveled up now. Um, yep, have a talk to him. Don't let him die. Yeah, I'm fine. 
Um, you'll score a fire gem and a soul of the demon. Speak to Sigrid, get the Sigbrow and the Torsten Mark too. Oh, it's telling, yep, 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 yep. Go around and get all the items up here. Ooh. Yeah, it's just saying the Flynn's Ring, Calanthe Ring, all good. Flynn's Ring and Calanthe Ring. Where's Onion Bro? Yeah, where the fuck? Oh, he's just there. Nice. Oh, what the f no. <laughs> I'll give you a fucking sink brow toast. I'll fucking do that, lad. Um, I'll go sleepy. Very nice. Okay. So you're getting the Flynn's ring and the Calanthe ring. You have options. I think I put on Fl I'll put on Flynn's ring. Flynn's ring would be nice. I think, for the extra little bit of damage. But yeah, no, honestly, I, it's hard to fault IGN here. They're, they're doing really well. It's hard to fault them. I think my only like, major complaint is that, that, you know, in all fairness, I was going to say they're kind of quips and they're kind of like, you know, like little retorts are quite kind of like less often than usual it is a lot more waffly like what i'm doing right now was like two whole pages i'm essentially saying here's the room here's the dog here's the chest here's the item it's like yeah but i can't but i have to say they're also having a bit of fun as well blow it out your ass <laughs> yeah there's 81 pages yeah it's a lot more pages all right, I think a Flynn's Ring is the one for me. Okay. Oh, shit, we're doing the... We're doing the rotted great wood. Yep. Assuming that you've done everything we asked so far, the path to the rotted great wood should be safe from the giant before. Oh, my God. Yep, they, they, are, they are doing that. Actually, it might be worth getting my uh, Estus Flask back. Have I got... Oh, I have got one. Cool. Actually, i tell you what. I'll do all my Estus. I'll do all my Estus. Yeah, I'm just going to turn over to the next page. We've got to put on your 11th ring slot. Oh. <laughs> um, I don't... They haven't said anything. Oh, wait, no, they said to save them, actually. They said to save them for sweet loot. Right, I'm going to make sure I've got a nice stock of arrows before we go any further. Oh, wait, I, I need to get... No, wait, 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 not yet, not yet, not yet. I need to buy the arrows first. Um... Oh, that's a nice number. I'm going to give, like, 200. Uh, you can have that, mate. Heaven, thank you. As... Goodbye. Hey, did you see a cat anywhere? Boys, if you've seen a little kitty cat, you're gonna tell me. Word on the street is a little fucking kitty cat around here. If you see him, you gotta let me know, right? Because I've been looking all over for him. You gotta let me know if he's been around, okay? I saw. Where? You guys saw him? What? Guys, if the kitty cat's here, you gotta let me know. Bro, you guys are lying. You guys are capping. You guys are capping. He was right there! Bro, he was right there! Oh, he's by. Let's uh, get there. Uh, oh my god, you can buy dancers set. That's so funny. Let's buy some of these. Let's keep it out on top of that. It said to put everything else in health. It's only two levels, but fair enough. Okay. We're just going to get to the great what right tree root here. Yep, it's the great water time. Nice little boss here. Keep in mind, boys. It doesn't... It, well, okay, this is the thing about this guide. It doesn't look like we've done much, right? But we're a quarter of the way through the guide. It is 81 pages. This is page fucking 21 now. We've done 20... That was all 20 pages. No fucking wonder. Cheeseburger Mage is fucking farming 20k souls in the tutorial. But, you know... Yeah, yeah, we're... That's a quarter of the way... It's mental, isn't it? Now, in all fairness, this is, again, something I don't include in the videos, but it's interesting. Towards the end, like, 
clearly they're right because I picked the day one. I picked the, the day one like release guides, right? Now, usually what happens is that they have like a writer's crunch. You know what I mean? Where they have to write. Oh wait, I didn't do the SSO. Oh, they have to write, you know, this article, get it out by release date. Now, usually what happens is at the start, like, you know, at the start, at the first, like, few bosses, it's really well illust illustrated, really well, like, you know, documented. But towards the end, when the crunch time starts happening, they start just fucking it up. So that was 20 pages for all, like, we're a quarter of the way through, believe it or not. And it's probably because towards the end of the guide, it's just, they're on a writer's crunch and they can't start missing shit out. But that doesn't matter. Because right now, we have our next boss. Now, the thing is, boys, this is one thing I didn't, okay. I've got something to show you. And, you know, like, the thing is, you know, the, 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 the whole, like, dragon meme. You know that, that, you know that dragon meme from before, like, the bridge? There's another one here. One thing I didn't mention is that the memes weren't a part of the guide. It was on a separate section. It was a like memes section. Now, I didn't put them all in because I don't like repeating the gags. But, so I, I, I didn't put all the memes in because I'm like, oh, we've already done that gag. I don't want to, you know, repeat it, even though IGN did. But I couldn't help but put this one in. Is there something fucking funny, boys? It's funny, boys. You've got to tell me, what's the fucking joke here? Because I don't understand that. Is that just, is it just essentially saying the tree's got cock cam? Is that what they're saying? <sighs> Prepare to be grossed out. This boss is, uh, interesting. This boss, the, 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 the battle doesn't start to get close. So take your time to look around. The boss is impervious to all attacks except in the pale sacks in various locations around its bodies. And the most obvious are its, uh, gonads. In brackets, um, yeah, seriously. Yeah, seriously, dude. This boss has got fucking a cock and balls, bro. This boss has got a fucking cock. This boss has got a fucking cock and balls, bro. You may be seem to do little damage, but when you hit them enough times, they'll burst, taking a huge chunk of boss energy. Oh my god, what the fuck? After, you, after you've smashed off its testicles, the boss will tantrum, as you would. I have to admit, if I had my testicles fucking smashed just, I'd, I'd, I'd throw a bit of tantrum. I'm gonna keep reading though. Oh wait, hang on. Now it, again, it's detailing a melee fight, but down here, if you find melee to be too risky, you do have the option of testing out your sniping skills with a bow. This is our preferred way of dealing damage to the boss, as it gives you more options of which testicle you would like to shoot you would like to shoot at. A normal Friday night for us then. Oh the local cock gobbler at the IGN office having a field day, man. The local cock gobbler at the IGN office having a field day. The local IGN cock gobbler is fucking winning today, man. Get in. Well, I'm clearing out the guys. <laughs> it, it says it. A normal Friday night for us. Sh having a choice of which testicle to shoot at. What's it trying to say? The local IGN cock gobble is about. What's... The Nah, my engine's weird. I don't know why I'm... Actually, these guys respawn. I don't know why I'm killing them. Actually, I should start sniping from here. What the fuck? This is a good game. I don't give a shit. Right, let's go. I have a chance to test out my sniping skills. Oh, fuck. I'm doing pretty good. Oh shit! I'm doing pretty good! Aim for the gonads. Oh, I will. Oh, I'm doing alright! 
Am I finished Liza P? No, I'm kind of like maybe like early mid, uh, early mid game. I'm really enjoying it. I'm streaming it here. I'll probably go back to streaming after I finish this. Oh, fuck. No, 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 bro, bro, bro. I want to get his hand. That's not the floor, is it? Oh, it is the floor. No way. Fair enough. I didn't think he did the floor thing until much later. Okay, sniping time. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, shit. Oh, I hate this bit of the fight. This, this actually part of the fight is actually quite hard. No cap. Oh, wait, I've got this bit. It, I got, oh, I hit the hand. Hey, 150 damage. I'll take it. All right, I want to be hitting that hand. It's almost burst. Where's it gone? Where's it gone? No, it's, there it is. Ah, don't know why I'm aiming that way. Oh, wait, I can get these. Are these actually real? They're not real? What the fuck? Get this guy? Yeah, nice. No. Ooh. Nice. Hello. Hello. How's it see you, Thanks for the sub there, man. Right. Get down here. Hit his hand again. Nice. Okay. Now we have options of which cock we want to shoot at. What's our optional cock blast up there? Is that one up? Ooh. I don't know. I don't know where our next cock blaster is. Oh, he's got an elbow. He's got one on his elbow. I think that counts. Uh, do they count up there? They don't. Does that count there? Oh, oh, that one counts. Oh, what a snipe! Elbow. Fuck. Shit. Oh. Nice, one more. Oh, I've just finessed that. IGN have finessed the situation pretty well there. Our sniping skills. In all fairness, we've had like fucking like Dark Souls 1 and Demon Souls bow only to practice that. But I'll, I have to admit, doing Dark Souls playthroughs makes you good at certain bits. And without IGN, I don't think my sniping would be that good. So fucking fair play to myself. The local IGN cock gobbler is going to be well buzzing with me. Going to be well fucking buzzing. On Shantae. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Right. Return to Phalanx Shrine with a transposing kill and give the Lud left. The tiny self-declared Lord of Cinder will hang out the throne. Trade boss souls for weapons if you fancy it. If not, feel free to use your soul once you know exactly what you're getting yourself in for. So yes, it's saying if I'm not interested in what the boss soul has to offer, I'm allowed to kind of pick whatever I like. So yes, 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 yes. We like that. I wish I could talk to you. This, I don't, don't, wait, does Dark Souls 3 have a little kitty cat? Does Dark Souls 3 have a little kitty cat? I don't know. Oh, wait, no, let's, let's check what Ludolf has to offer. Nope. Yes, nope. Does it? That's not a kitty cat, bro! No. Oh, it has a cat ring, that's true. That's true. Am I inter I'm not interested in any of this. Nah, I'm selling the soul. I don't give a fuck. I'm selling the soul. Stealthy pumpkin, thank you for the sub there, man. Thank you. We're in a bunch of subs tonight, guys. I really appreciate every single one. If you're new here and you wonder what subs do, you get emotes and stuff. And it's, it's, I get a, a, a cut of the money. I think they're 25% off now, which I, you know, if you wanted to. But don't feel like you have to. I just think it's really, you know, it's just really nice. It's not like I'm begging for subs. It's just nice to see, like... You know, there's something about these IGN videos. I'm gonna buy a staff because we need one for if we do magic later. No, actually, it'll tell me what it'll tell me what staff I need to get. It's it, I don't do these IGN videos often, but I like it when I do because you're getting you know, loads of viewers and stuff. It's nice. I'm not trying to say oh I want viewers and I want subs. I'm just saying like when the IGN guide does something funny like the boiled dancer cheese, and then you see the chat go a million miles per hour. It, it looks great for the video. So honestly, thanks for showing up, guys. I really appreciate it. It, it, it makes the video look great. There's loads of kind of like hype and stuff. It looks awesome. So, yeah, I really appreciate it. I really do. Okay. We're back down to... Um, I guess we'll go from here and walk around. Because now it wants to go to the Road of Sacrifices. Yeah, we're off to the Road of Sacrifices. I didn't get that shortcut there, so. But yeah, no, seriously, like, I hope you guys don't think I'm, like, kind of, like, 
begging for views and like, so upset. It's just, it's just, it looks awesome for the video. If you have a bunch of people going, oh, well, what the fuck and stuff, you know. And as far as subs go, honestly, I, I hope you don't think I'm begging for subs. It's just, I think it's really nice to see, like, it's nice when I see, like, someone who's, like, just subbed for the first time because it shows me, oh, no, people are still discovering me for the first time, you know. It's not about, like, you know, oh, you have to, this is a pay-to-win stream. No, it's like, it's just nice to see, oh, look, people are still like, kind of finding me for the first time. It's just a nice feeling, that's all. Can't afford five fucking dollars. <laughs> Thanks for the sub there, Juvenile. Jackal, thank you, man. See, that's it. With Prime Gaming too. If you, if you have Amazon Prime, you have a free sub to give to someone. That's really sweet. You know, that guy, he's like, oh, I've got, I, I don't watch Fortnite Ninja. I'll give it, I'll give it to Lenny. It's really sweet of you. It really is. Oh, thank you, killer. Thank you. I really appreciate them all. I really I appreciate every single one. I really do. I tell you why I appreciate them. Because, you know, I understand that, you know, it's really easy to take, like, I, 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 I do, like, subscribe and I do, like, some people's Patreons. But only because I have money, like, you know, spare money. Money is really hard these days, man. I really appreciate if you guys, you know, it's, it's just sweet. It, for some people, it might be a lot. It's really, uh, you know, it's really nice. Oh, fuck. Nice. Well, you guys, uh, right, right. When I'm, uh, I'm, I'm talking about it because it's, it's, I think it's an interesting conversation. I'm not talking about it to beg for subs, but I appreciate the five subs, Gooby. That's a good name, Gooby. Thank you, Gooby. Nah, it's just like, honestly. Okay, one more thing. One more thing about this thing though is that on Twitch, my, my streams and stuff, my Twitch is way smaller. Tantrum. I love that a lot. Thank you, Gooby, and thank you, uh, Meme Faf. Thanks, guys. That's really sweet of you. Um, oh, no. Don't give me money, please. <laughs> Shut up. Listen. This is what, okay, so this, is, this is why I think it's important to thank people. Because even though my Twitch is way smaller than my YouTube, I do actually make equal amounts here than YouTube. So you guys actually compete with YouTube way bigger than me. All right. Road of Sacrifice is halfway forward. Well, we're done here. And we're never going back that way again. Out of the way, you fucking weeboo trash. Serious spicy boy coming through. Thank you, Lord Cubs, for the 10. 200 and total. Are you kidding me? It's a good feeling, isn't it? The true Dark Souls starts here. Oh, they're saying it every single area. I'm not joking, boys. It's every area. Sorry, this is the true Dark Soul. The true Dark Soul starts here, boys. They're saying it every area. Guys, okay, thank you for the 10 that... Guys, thanks for the fucking hell. Thanks for the subs. This is what I'm on about. It looks sick for the video. If you guys, like, you guys all spamming it and stuff, it looks sick for the video. <laughs> if, if the people joining it, if you're wondering why we're saying it, on the first page, it said... When we got to a new area, the true Dark Souls starts here. As the Souls fans like to say every time we hit a new area. So we just we just say it now. Thanks for the 10 there, Cups and man. I really appreciate that. So, again, like it's it's just a it's a it's really support. And I guess like the reason why I thank it so much is that you guys literally compete with a YouTube channel, like quadruple this size on Twitch behalf. You know, and oh boy as well, thank you. So honestly, you guys outperform a YouTube company. So fucking, that's why it's uh, after, you know, so grateful of it. Yep. Again, this is the thing about this guide. It is pretty funny. This is the thing where we're getting firm to the future now. It's a bit of a shame. We have had some funny moments at the Cheeseburger Mage, I have to admit, but this guide is a lot more waffly than the other ones. A lot of, go ahead, pick up the soul of the undead traveler. Then go around, there's gonna be two enemies here. Pick them off of you. It's just a lot of the kind of blah, the blah, go ahead, pick up the enemy, go, 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 It's like. The other ones had a lot of the charm and smarm on every paragraph. But these ones are just, again, it's like at that point where they're starting to become self-aware. Oh fuck, oh. Nothing's come with a cheeseburger mage yet. You got fifth, fifth, 30 in for nothing. Yeah, right. Nothing yet, but it's prepping us for the future. Bomb. 
personal, no, there's no personal death count, but we have taken the IGN challenge. We are trying to beat this game in 68 hours. We're trying to beat their in-game, oh fuck. We're trying to beat their in-game time. Oh fuck, no, 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 no. Also, I really appreciate people, you know, I've got a lot of uh, reading what people say, like, derpy squid there. A lot of people say, hey, you know, I've never seen a stream, but I appreciate the streams are really do The videos are really condensed. Oh my fucking lord, I'm getting ambushed here. The streams are really condensed, so the videos. And the streams are really different, so I really appreciate, you know, giving it a go. Turns out you might not like the streams, they're like, kind of boring. At least you give it a chance, I appreciate that. We're floored. We fucking are, Nebulous Clem. We fucking are. There's a guy called DLC. No, we're saving DLC for one last IGN, like, tr it's to finish the trilogy. What we're going to do at the end of this guide, we're going to add up the scores, the total scores from IGN 1, 2, and 3 all together, then do the, like, the IGN DLC bonanza. Are we being followed? Are we all good? Um. Oh, fucking Jesus Christ. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. nice. All right. I'm trying to read the guide. Um, you pass through the pillars ahead. Yeah, it's just like going down and talking to Horace and Anri. Cool, cool, cool. It's just pass through. It just says pass through. But yeah, seriously, like, I appreciate the streams are really different from videos. So if you do, I just appreciate you guys showing up. And for the video, it looks sick having lots of people talking. It looks like really hype. So honestly, I appreciate. You know, I don't. I don't really watch streams in my spare time. I watch a lot of videos, so I get it. I really appreciate you guys kind of coming down and making a cool effort out of it, though. Right. Talk to Horace and Anri on the left hand side. We don't know what we don't know what their deal is, but it seems like Horace has a bit of a crush on Anri because he's too shy to talk. You got this, bro. Go get her, tiger. Oh, go get her, tiger. Go fucking get her, tiger. Get her down. Go get, get her fucking... Go get her, tiger. Go get her, tiger. All right. Thank you for that, man. If... Oh, hang on, hang on. We have plot development. If you would like... To use our aforementioned cheese burger mage. Then our staff of choice can be obtained right now. Go back and farm the Corvian shamans for the storyteller's staff. Not only does the staff allow you to cast a nasty magic spell, there's also another amazing feature. By placing it in your left hand, you get access to its weapon art. A huge poison mist cloud. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. It's like King of Lant all over again, boys. This is extremely handy for upcoming our next cheesy boss. Even if you are a mage, it'd be still you. Well, we are farming this guy. This Corvian mage. We can't poison one, you know, no, no. King of Lant. If you guys don't remember, on the eye, uh, no, actually, no, it was Game Facts. Fuck, I forgot, it was Game Facts. Hey, Call for Ward. And Jobless Pickle. Thanks for the subset, guys. Prime Gaming. Thanks, guys. I really appreciate those. I'm just farming this guy for the staff. What's the drop rate, guys? Guys, guys, what's the drop rate? I'm gonna be here for 68 hours. Take the IGN. <laughs> Take the IGN challenge. 4%, 2%. Uh, can we use cheat engine? No, 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 no. Yeah. Thankfully, the stag is bleeding. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fucking no. Where do you get the gold serpent ring? Doesn't matter, Derpy Squid. The guy said not to get it. I've not got it yet. I do what the guy. I do what the fucking guide says. People in chat like, oh, get the uh, get the gold ring. I do what the fucking guide says. Fuck who? Cat 
happening, please? Check about that one. That one's pretty good. I hope we can use the stuff, by the way. Oh, you fucker. Oh, I'm gonna be here all fucking day. Could still just follow on. Oh, man. It's fine, it's fine. Guys, we've done worse. We've done worse. We'll be fine. We've done way. We've got 20 castles in the tutorial, boys. We'll be fine. Come on, come on, come on. Hello, Shandix. Nice to see you. Yeah, if you just come in and you wonder what all this, the true darks. Oh, no, I've already explained that. I've already explained that. So it gives me a bit of time to talk to you guys. Have I got another story? Can I do another story? What can I do for another story? Maybe it's, it's time for it's another story time. Story time? We had a good story before. If I, okay, guy, you know. Yeah, fuck shit! No time for story time! Fuck y'all! That's it, baby! Woo! Yeah, baby, no, no story time! No story time! That's it! Nice! Now, honestly, um, I think it's best, you know, save, you know, we, we don't want to do two stories in one day. Right, well, you gotta space them out for the video, you know, you gotta make them good. Right, it said, well, I'm gonna take that off. It said in the left hand, for the weapon art, let's give it a try. Well, I guess it's just the normal, yeah, it's just a toxic mist under, uh, I wonder if it's toxic or poison. Anyway, let's keep going. Yeah, let's go. Oh, ooh, hang on. Yeah, this is where... I don't know. Sorry, it's talking about the Crucifixion Woods now. Here we go. Bam, bam. Let's get a nice little view there. God, my fashion looks sick. Go ahead and bit their fashion souls. Hashtag fashion born. It's on point. This is where Dark Souls 3 stops fooling... What the fuck? This is where Dark Souls 3 stops funneling you through a one-way road. It's really not. This game is... This game is always a one-way road. And starts giving you some options. These include dying in the wet, dying in the dry, getting lost, being murdered by invaders, an average night out in London, if you ask us. Oh. Okay, Arjun, that's actually a half decent joke. Fuck you. I'll give you that one. That's, a, uh, that's not even that bad. That's, that's all right. I'll give you that one. I don't give a fuck. If you use the ember or you haven't died since the last boss, you won't be safe if you're uh, from an NPC invader called Yango F Yellowfinger Herschel, gawding about the place in Far and Keep. Try to murder him at least once for his sweet hat. Ooh, summon phantom it. You know what? The guide says summon phantom, summon, summon a phantom if you want kind of some help. It's just, there's some co-op help. Should we do some co-op help? The guide at the start says if you want to do co-op, We'll do co-op. That's what it said. Do you want to do some co-op for a bit? Now I'm wondering, has it? Oh fuck! I'm wondering, has anyone? You know, I am on PC. I'm on the banned server. I did say at the start of the stream, I would much prefer people if I do. You know, if I do have some co-op, if people use the same build as me. I don't know if people have been following along. I don't know if uh, I think it's a bit too hard, but if you want to try, if you want to try for a bit, we'll try. Mind you, I am banned. I am banned. So, uh, I've got a password. Hang on. Password is IGN. I don't think we'll find anyone. I am on a banned. Wait, wait, hang on. Hang on a sec, it's, it's co-op. Guys, it's co-op time. It's co-op time. Come on. You've been penalized. Invalid game data. What invalid game data? What's invalid? The true Dark Souls starts here. Hmm. 
Right, I'm gonna sit around for a bit. Can we get anyone? Can I kill this guy? Oh, wow. <sighs> Dear to front. You got banned for being a cheesy burger mage. Just me, baby. Proud of it. I'm proud of being the cheeseburger mage. Oh. Okay. Now, I don't think anyone's on the banned server for me, is there? I don't think there's anyone on, on the banned server. It's just me, baby, on the banned server, isn't it? Well, that's me fucked. Right then. No, no co-op for me then, baby. Sorry about that, guys. But hey, follow along if you want anyway, because it's a right piece of shit. All right. There's a load of yokels <laughs> roaming around town down here. And the water is full of crabs. Really not a problem. And giant crabs. Ah, huge problem. Which can't be killed with arrows. Because they go underwater. Yep. Most items here are just green blossoms. But also a grass crest shield. Fairly close to the shore. It's right there. I can see it right now. Which is definitely worth picking up and using. Simply having this equipped gains you some insane stamina regeneration abilities. So put this one on and never take it off. Well, I'm using the staff. So I guess I'll just never use it. Take it everywhere with you. To Irithyll, the castle, the shops, the beach. We mean everywhere. Um... Take it to the beach, little beach holiday. Oh, we're going down to the, the, the Dark Knight. The, the, the Dark Black Knight. It says the Dark Knight. It's the Black Knight. Oh, we're sniping him. And then we're going to the Crystal Sage for our next boss. Cool, 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 cool. So we get that. Put it on. And we're not taking this bad boy off. Oh, now there's this fucking dickhead. Can't be fucking arsed. Oh, can't be arsed, man. I can't be fucked. Can't be fucked. Down here. Right. Get this call back here. Am I still being followed? You can't skip the sweet hat. Oh, I'll get the sweet hat. Don't worry about it. Is he casting spells over there? Oh, wait. It said. Sorry, I was reading the guide before. So the idea is, is that I want to be going up here, shooting him, and alternating up and down. So the idea is, is that I do aggro him now. Nice shot. And then I just go up this little thing here. I just keep cycling up, him up and down. Apparently. Oh, fuck. What are you doing here? Um. Uh, um. Um. Hi. Shit. Oh, stamina. No, 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 bro. No, what am I doing? I, mean, I, I don't have any magic to cast. I've, I've got 13 touches. No, no magic to cast. Right, cool. Right. Okay. Where's the Where's the Black Knight gone? What the fuck's he doing? Can I hit him from here? Can the cheeseburger mage... Wait, can I poison him through a wall? Cheeseburger mage. He's right there. He's right there. Oh! The cheeseburger mage strikes again, boys. It's another one. It's another point for the IGN, boys. They're laughing. They're fucking drinking it in tonight, boys. Oh, they are winning tonight. Shit. That shagged it. So now I just go down here. Cheeseburger 
Cheeseburger mage activated. Oh, <gasps> Cheeseburger mage. Oh, he's walking. He's walking. Poison, please, poison. Poison, please, poison, 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 poison. It's a devilish co- Oh, wow. It's a devilish combo, is it not? Now it's time for Herschel. Now, I don't think we can get a poison on Herschel. Herschel won't be so lucky. Or will it? Or will he? Get in here, mate. Herschel, you little dipshit. Get over here, then. Oh, you little cock sniff. That didn't work, did it? <sighs> right, we're good, we're good, we're good. Herschel. I could totally beat you in a range fight. We have to cast a spell. Fuck you. Okay, we're good. Oh, I'm beating you. Oh, well, fuck yes. This. Hey, can't watch Kazim working, but I hope you're having fun. Oh, I'm having the time of zero fucking life. Pog, zero, pog, zero, pog. zero fucking pog is right, lad. I want that sweet heart. Get over here. I want that sweet fucking heart. Cheeseburger mage versus hamburger mage. <laughs> oh, piss. I best kill this guy so this guy can come in so I can get the kill on this guy. Stamina? We're good. We're good. No. No. Oh, fuck, he's here. No, no. Okay, we're good, we're good. Boom. Alrighty. Honestly, uh, his magic's not doing too much to me. Out of Estus. Yeah, I'm beating... Thankfully, my magic's kind of beating him. To his punches. There we go. Thankfully, i got a lot... The guy's doing a good job of kind of gathering all the Estus, too. So I'm even pretty good here. Oh, shit. Use the pillar. Nice. Use the pillar. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Dear me. Dear fucking me, he can't do a fucking thing. The Cheeseburger Mage is tearing apart Dark Souls 3 tonight, boys. We're off to the Crystal Sage. Cool hat time. Put that fucking cool hat on. That looks dog shit. Honestly, we're doing really fucking good. I like how the guy got us to put on the stamina shield, even though we're not fucking ever using it, because we're using the fucking mage thing. Can't even quit the bastard. Shit. No. No. Nice, right, get up here. Alrighty, nicey, nice, nice. Oh, wait, no, oh, can't sit down. Oh! Bum, bam, 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 bam. Excellent. Okay. Trek to Crystal, yeah, the Trek to Crystal Sage is a bit of a to uh, chore. You'll be able to skip a lot of it later if you tick a few boxes. Yep, 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 we just did. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, shit, guys. More Cheeseburger Mage lore incoming. More, it says to get this little Estus thing down here first, though. More Cheeseburger Mage lore incoming, guys. Nothing actually didn't say anything about Hodrick, surprisingly. Ember here too. And we go all the way up. There was a summon sign, what, by the bonfire? Or was that you mean Hodrick's one? Bomb. Uh oh. No. Yeah, it was Hodrick's cool. All right, guys. Hey, piss off, lad. Get the fuck out of here, bitch boy. Nice. 
we have a bit more of the cheese. But guys, 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 come on. A lot of people, a lot of people have been asking me, why has it got 30 intelligence? We've not done anything with it. Hang on now. Upstairs here, you will find Orbeck of Vinheim. He's a friendly NPC. If your intelligence stat is 10 or greater, ask him to teach you sorceries. He'll promise and promise him to bring you any scores you find. He'll transport you to Phanic Shrine as a sorcery vendor. He is very important for cheeseburger mages. For the cheeseburger mage. Well, oh, let's just go up and see him. Guys, this is it. This is our guy. This is our fucking guy. I really hope IGN don't fuck up his quest and make him leave and lock him out of all vendor options. But I digress. Here we are. Yes, mate. I will bring you a fucking scroll. This is a what you? This is my, if you have it. Yeah. How Very well. Indeed, I am. This guy is going to bring the cheeseburger mage into the fucking real world right now. Well. Make a promise. Oh, fuck it. That's an IGN promise. That, oh, Beck, don't take it from me, mate. That's an IGN promise right there, mate. Fuck off. Well, she got here. When he's gone, enjoy a good roll <laughs> through his stuff. Amazing. Oh, wow. Yeah. Woo. Yeah, baby. That's it. Amazing. Circle on the upper layer and go back downstairs. That's everything here. So head ahead. So go ahead to the opposite entrance to the boss arena. Get his little bugs here. I'm going to take out... Uh, actually, no. No, I'll take out this guy here so we'll do some the boss reading before the boss starts. And get a bleed. Thank you. Does the other guy follow me? No, he doesn't. Alrighty. Well, it is the Crystal Sage. Let's see. Now, this one, honestly, uh, some people struggle with this one, so... Some people struggle with this one. I know a lot of newcomers do, so let's see what well, IGN has in store for the Crystal Sage. The Crystal Sage has several magic attacks, and one is a standard but oversight power. Oh, I just lists all the attacks. Oh. Now, hang on. There's a section. Now, it, now all, the, all it's doing here is listing the attacks. I can't see anything too out of the ordinary. But there's a little, uh, there's a little section down here in bold or if you've been following our guide the storyteller's staff can cheese this boss very easily just poison the boss and stand behind a pillar once phase two starts shoot the clones of your bow reapply poison as needed until the die until the boss dies of pooping itself oh i'm this boss is gonna fucking shit the bed mate Get it in here. Cheeseburger mage. Let's fucking have it. Cheeseburger mage. Oh my, it's instant poison. And what? We just go here? <laughs> Fuck off. Ma Come on. Oh wait, this, this, one, this one might hit us. Um, yeah, okay. We just keep going between these two. Fucking hell. I mean, you can't argue with results. It's worth. Oh, yeah, I have to roll that one. It's pretty great to be honest. Oh, no, no, this, this is what I'm saying. Okay, no, this is what I'm saying, though. Do you remember at the start of the guide when it said other people will poo poo this approach? And it's okay to. And they had that whole big section. It's okay to cheese. I absolutely agree. I really hit. I, I, wait, the. And the, I remember in the, in, the, in the intro, the IGN guys themselves said that the whole half joking but half serious get good thing. It's just like, you know, you have to play the game the true way. It's like, fuck that. People are going to poo poo it. Oh, wait, after it reappears, it's still being poisoned. Wow. After it reappears, it's still poisoned. That's sick. So then I just, I just kill the clones. I just kill the clones, and that's it. Because the thing is, with the poison, it's not registering me as a threat. So it's not teleporting away every 10 seconds. Oh, wait, the poison ran out. 
I have to go reapply. Reapply as needed, it said. But this is what I'm saying. Do you remember at the start of the guide, it said people poo-poo this approach? There's no poo-pooers in the chat. This is what I'm saying. I actually really don't like the whole get good thing either. Because think about it, man. These games are hard enough, man. And when someone beats these games, sure, through very cheesy cheeseburger-made strategy such as this, well, they're just having fun. They're, they're having fun, man. They bought a game for sixty dollars and they're having a good time with it. They're not like I hear it when people say, "No, you gotta beat this game the true way." No summons with no cheesing. It's like I didn't. No one. You shouldn't be playing. You should not be playing Dark Souls for some, for other people to refer you and say, "Oh, you beat the game the true way." Well done. Fuck that. I have to say. It. If you're offended by this cheesy kind of, oh, you can't teach newcomers to cheese stuff, you have to play the game. If you're offended by that, imagine this, this is absolutely true. If you're offended by that, there's someone out there in the world right now who's probably followed this guide. And they probably had a more fun time doing that than you. Simple as. I, by doing that, that's probably one of the most fun times I've ever had in a long time. Say what you want. Say you didn't beat the game the true way. Get good. But fuck, man. I'm having fun. I'm not playing Dark Souls so some sweaty geek online can refer me and say, oh, you beat it. No. I'm, I pay $60 for a game. I want it to be fun. Fuck it. And that's that. All right. Well, we're about three hours and a half in. I was thinking about maybe ending it here for the day. I was thinking about ending it here for the day. You know, I spent about coming back tomorrow because I'm pretty hungry and we're doing pretty, we're doing really well. We're doing really well. We're at page 27 out of 81. We're about a quarter of the way in. We're about a quarter of the way in. But before we before we end, I'm just gonna kind of read off a little bit here, and that's and that is that. Oh, what's that? You thought you were going onwards from the Crystal Sage? Wrong. There's more swamp adventures to be had. Yippee! The real Dark Souls starts here. If anyone needs to pee now, hands up. We're not turning this car around until we're back towards. The <laughs> if anyone needs to pee now, hands up. We're not turning this car around until we're back towards the crucifixion woods. Guys, I need a pee. That's it. Fuck it. Day's over. I need a pee. Fuck this. Guys, before we end, we are the real Dark Souls is starting here. So guys, come back for day two because the real Dark Souls starts there. We are at page 27 out of 81. Hard to believe that all of that it's like a third. We're a third of the way in. And we're only here. It's crazy to think, but take the IGN challenge. Can we beat it in 68 hours? Well, <laughs> maybe. Right, that will do us for day one. Guys, you're going to have to join us back tomorrow for the same time tomorrow. For the, the real Dark Souls starts tomorrow. The real Dark Souls starts tomorrow, guys. you got to join us back then. You gotta join us back then. Guys, what a lovely day that was. All sorts of fun there. Right, guys. Thank you all so much. What a day it's been. Well, well, I think we were... Honestly, I was a bit worried about the guide. No, no joke, guys. I was a bit worried about it. I was worried about the guide, you know, not being funny because it's quite old. It's quite a modern guide. I think it's been quite the fun one, don't you think? I think it's been pretty good so far. Right. Guys, same time tomorrow. Do not poo-poo the approach. Same time tomorrow. I'll be going again. I don't know how far I'm going to get. If we keep up the pace, if we keep up the pace, we'll get to Irithyll, according to these page numbers. If we keep up the pace. Right, guys. Don't say thank you all so fucking much, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We'll be back tomorrow for more IGN Dark Souls 3. And remember, guys, if you think it's over, it's not fucking over. The real Dark Souls starts tomorrow.